Sriracha hot, chili sauce, jelly. Yes. Oh, so good. Mm. Licking good chicken. Sriracha hot, chili sauce, jelly.
小心，还有中国！现在我有冰淇淋。That's not good. That's not good at all, Kiss. Real quick, though. What the fuck is wrong with my fingers? Do you see how, like, the color? Why do the tips look so purple? I'm over I'm over here stroking my shit. I got lotion on my dick. Okay? I'm over here stroking my shit and I got lotion on my Okay, stream froze. I got lotion on my dick. I'm over here stroking my shit. First of all, what I want to say to you is that that's hilarious. That sound bite is amazing. I got lotion on my I'm over here stroking my shit. I got Lotion on my dick. I mean, that's... I don't know if it's that exact thing. It might be, I'm over here stroking my dick. I got lotion on my dick. But I think it's funnier to say I got... I'm over here stroking my shit. And I got lotion on my dick. But uh, what I want you to know about this... Is how fucked up that soundbite is. Do you know the story behind that soundbite? That... Soundbite... I'm over here stroking my shit. I got lotion on my dick. Was some guy who sent that voice message to a minor to elicit sex to a minor. And the world, for some reason, decided that's this soundbite. Let's start putting that around everywhere. I'm pretty sure that's the story, is that it's some guy who was doing weird sh I think he's like some famous guy, or I don't know, some streamer, or I don't know what he is. And he was, he, that's where that sound comes from. And I, don't you think it's a little fucked up that that sound bite is just played in places? Kind of fucked up, right? Hilarious, but not for the right reasons, once you know the backstory on it. So... Yeah, I'm over here stroking my shit. I got lo I got lotion on my dick. Holy fuck. I'm coming. Kiss, you got COVID, and that's not good. That sucks. COVID is honestly horrible. When I had it, I'm not going to say I'm not I don't want to make things worse for you. I just hope you get it better. I just hope you get better. I don't know if you were watching me when I had COVID. When I, I did a couple of streams, I think, when I was still dealing with the aftermath of it, and it was not fun. So, I, I hey, I pray for you, all right? Heavenly, oh, Father, oh, Son, suck my dick. Um, hey, I listen, I got to show you some things here, okay? Uh, and this is probably going to be the grossest thing I've ever talked about on this stream. And I know I talk about a lot of really gross things on this stream, okay? I, 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 the, honestly, things I've probably said are worse than what I'm going to show you right now, okay? But to me, this is disgusting, okay? Let me see what you're saying here. You, Harmon's had COVID four times. That's because he's working. He's wor That's a working man right there. That guy's out in the public just getting COVID, and that's fucked up. Harmon, that sucks. 
You know there's a thing? Well, let's see. I've been back to the gym for two weeks and already got sick. I'm pissed. Yeah, that does suck. That does suck, especially because you wanted to get them gains. You wanted to get healthy. And then you get sick, and then it really just dials back all the progress. But hey, just take, you know, just take the time. Just take the time to chill out. There's like a there's like a thing there's like a brain frog that you get a brain frog a bane oh my god a brain bane bros you get bang bros after you get covid you get brain fog after you get covid and it can last like months to weeks weeks to months after covid and it's like this like they call it the covid depression and now I, I didn't like I was like what the fuck is this after I had covid and that's like a real thing so, Harmon, I don't know how you stayed sane. I got depressed. I got real depressed. Maybe I'm just a little bitch, though. Probably. Probably just a little bitch. All right. Here's my story. It's really gross. This is the grossest thing. Uh, first of all, I want to say, I think I'm a pretty clean and organized person, if I do say so myself. And um, I uh, know you probably don't think that I'm very clean. Because I talk about shit and cum and jizz, and I'm just all around kind of rambunctious. And usually if someone's rambunctious and silly and jokey, maybe you kind of expect them to be kind of dirty. You know, kind of like, ooh, he touches like snails at recess and then touches his face and he's got warts. He's got genital warts. No, I actually, I think I'm a pretty clean person, right? But, sometimes things happen. I didn't have any food, really, and so, uh, I, you know, it's, uh, it's, it's been snowing and stuff, I didn't get a chance to go to the grocery store, so I was, you know, hey, I was looking through my cupboards, what do I got? Okay, hey, box of macaroni, sure, that sounds good, okay? Now, I have to say, this is store brand macaroni, okay? It wasn't any, you know, craft. it wasn't Velveeta, it was just store brand macaroni. Okay, so what do I do? Get the water going, boil it up. Open up that package. Take out the little cheese powder. You know, put that to the side. Okay, water's boiling. Salted the water a little bit. You know, get it, get it nice and uh, boiling, boiling hot there. You know, salt the water for the for the pasta. Pour the pasta in. Okay, it's boiling there. Oh, I'm looking at it. Whoa, what are those little specks that I'm seeing in there? There's like these little like brown looking like things in there. And what did I find in there? I'll tell you what I found. Brace for impact here. Fuck. That's not what I found. This is what I found. This. And a lot of them. A lot of those. And so, I started freaking out. I was like, great. If, if nature's seasoning is in one box of macaroni, what else is in that cupboard? So what I did is, first of all, I have uh, wooden cabinets, and, and there's liners in there, okay? So I took everything out of the cabinets, and I... First of all, that thing was dead, by the way. That thing was dead. All the ones that I found were dead. I pulled up the, the liner, and I just see a whole fucking graveyard of, of these things. So my kitchen is absolutely wrecked right now. And I've been going through every single goddamn cabinet. I had to take all the liners out. I had to clean them. They're setting they're setting up to dry. So time to set the entire kitchen on fire just to make sure they're all gone. Uh, pretty much that's what I'm doing. So let me see if I can do this. I might fuck up the camera by doing this, but everything is a goddamn mess in here. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see this here, but like, I mean, I got, I just, there's shit all over the place there. I mean, with, you know, I mean like, You know, yeah, microwave on top of the fridge. That's a toaster oven. Yes, uh, I don't have any fucking room because I'm running out of things. It's a, you know a small place, but uh, uh, everything's empty and uh, I'm you know it's all fucked up. So I'm pissed. I'm pissed. I think I'm a pretty clean guy, but uh, bugs just get in. And what I don't know is how long have the bugs been there? 
Shit, hold on, I gotta fix my camera. Okay, I think that's good. I don't know how long, I don't know how long the bugs have been there, or whether or not you bought something at the store and it was already present there. You know, it was the larva, was ar the larvae was already in the box and you brought it home and they hatched and then spilled out all over. But anyways, they were all up in that top drawer. They're all up in the bottom drawer. They were in the seasoning cabinet. I mean, it's so, I don't know, I'm fucked. I feel like I just want to throw everything over, throw, throw everything out and start all over. That's what I was going to try to say there. Um, but anyways, yeah, it's pissing me off. Pissing me off for sure. Bitch, you ain't no nerd. Fuck. Pissing me off. There we go. Um, still cleaner than Asmund Gold's house. Yes, yes. Burn it all. I yeah, I want to. So, um, you know, after the stream ends, I'm gonna spend some more time cleaning. I'm letting those fucking liners dry, or else I would have put everything back, but I can't. So, gonna put everything back. And this is what I'm also gonna do. I'm gonna get mason jars, and I think I'm just gonna start putting everything in fucking jars. And any single time I want to make pasta, I'm going to put that shit out on a plate and inspect it. I'm done. I don't know. I fucking hate bugs. I hate them. I think it's my number one thing I hate most in life is, is insects. I'm going to tell you a fucked up story. I remember, uh, you know, living with, uh, living with, uh, uh, at my mom's house. Okay. Um, Living with Czech Dio, living with uh, my sister, you know, living, living, with, living at mom's house, and um, I have to say that her mom is not the cleanest. Nor does she go through and throw things away. Sometimes she'll just have shit in her cabinet that's just expired, and it's like this should be thrown away, but it just doesn't. And I think this is not just a thing that is um, prevalent with just my mother. This is just this is just an old person thing. You ever see this video? There's a TikTok video of them clean doing the annual clean out of their mom's fridge. And she's got, it's this woman, you know, who has uh, like expired ketchup and mayonnaise. And she's like had it for like over five years. And she's like, no, 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 don't throw it away. It's still good. It's like that weird hoarder mentality. Anyways, back at mom's house was deep cleaning. Oh, I wasn't deep cleaning. I got to say my sister was deep cleaning. And... She, we looked back in the cabinet, you know, real deep back there. Shit's that, shit that's been in there for like probably over 10 years. And there's just maggots, dead maggots, grown on top of the cans. And I, I remember thinking to myself, hey, you know, I was younger. I was like, if I ever move out, have my own place, I never want to have that happen. I never want to experience that. And now here I am. Got some type of fucking whatever the hell this is i think it's like a it's like a some type of beetle it's a larva i don't know what it is i don't know what i don't know what these things are i tried looking it up i don't i can't find out what it is so anyways here's my message to you i'm thinking of you when you're out there and i'm over here sh oh fuck yeah i'm over here stroking my shit i got lotion on my dick i gotta hold on the bit rate's too high and i'm freezing the fucking stream here um Here's my message to you. Check your cabinets. Check your, check your, check your, uh, check your shit. Make sure you ain't, you don't got an infestation like me. You can, even though you might be the cleanest person on the world, if it's been a while, check out your cabinets. I don't even know what to find that video. Um, annual throwing out mom's fridge. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to find it. I'm not gonna be able to find this. Oh wait, yeah, it's this these one. These kids. Okay, yeah. Here we go. This is the video. It's one of these stupid like. These kids took a shit in their mom's house, and mom flipped out. <laughs> oh, whoa! Check their mom's fridge for expired things, and what they found in there was crazy. They even found stuff that was expired back in 2015. What is it? Oh, it's chunky. Ugh. Definitely gonna get copyright struck from this fucking music, but it's funny though. It's funny. It's funny. I don't know what that. You know, hey, listen. A lot of that shit, it has a date on it, right? But it's Best Buy date. It's not Best Buy like electronic store. It's like it's a, it's a Best Buy date, not 
not does it expire on this date. You know, a milk carton, that's an expiry date that you have on there, not a Best Buy date. So, you know, even if something is says it's from 2023 and it's only a couple months into 2024 you know like generally it, you'll be okay but hey maybe i'm privileged maybe it's a first world problem I, eh, i'm gonna throw it away okay sorry it's done I'm, I'm done with it okay i don't care i don't give a shit yeah i get it people are dying people are starving i get it i'm a piece of shit okay sprinkle much can sprinkle yes yeah. all right Old, it was inspired in 2015. That's older than most TikTok users. Yeah, it is. Um, anyways, that's disgusting to me. It's disgusting. I don't know. You know, I've had some hot sauces in my fridge. Actually, I, this, I, only a couple months ago did I do this, and I was looking at the uh, expiration date on them, and like, yeah, they were saying 2021. I felt like a jackass having that in my fridge for so long. So I finally threw that all away. I feel, still feel like I gotta go through this whole kitchen tonight. I will. After the stream ends, I gotta be Oh, yeah. That's what, that's what I feel like, Max. I feel like a crackhead. I feel like a fucking crackhead. Hey, all right. So let's change it up. Let's get, let's get happy. Here's the thing. I um, haven't done a lot of work on either the stream or just in life. But something we did do... Something I did do is I did go through and organize. Hopefully, this is organized on your end. The channel points here, you can see here. Um, they're a little bit more, so like the farts are all together. Uh, some of the more sound bite type things are all together. The Joey's are together. The Badlands Chugs are together. Um, you know, hopefully things are just a little bit easier and organized to understand. And so like you don't have to f struggle with trying to find where each channel point is. So there you go. I hope you enjoy that. I hope that makes it. Uh, I hope you make that makes that easier. Uh, also, there's a price reduction on a lot of these things too. A lot of these things are a lot more expensive, and I've lowered them. So spam away. You know, I don't give a shit. Do whatever you want. Fuck it. Spend those points. They're just sitting there doing nothing. So, you know, you can do whatever you want. You can do whatever. You know, I got rid of some things too. Um, you know, I got rid of the Raiden. I got rid of that. Oh. Shit. Okay, that's loud. I should fix that. That was loud on my end. Was that loud on your end? That was fucking loud. Um. All right. Well, you get to choose my loadout. Okay. There you go. You spent a thousand points. That's right. I don't know if that's uh. It's it's a little bit. Uh, oh fuck you, kiss. God damn it. I don't have that. I don't have that. No. I wish I did, but, um, <laughs> oh man, and I still have a horrible cough. I sound better, but, um, I still have a horrible cough, so I apologize. No, uh, this is, this is how this is going to work, okay? You choose my loadout, that includes the, the, uh, frame, the primary, the secondary, and the melee, and I'll use it for a mission or two, okay? Or, you know, if I, maybe if I enjoy it, I'll keep it longer. So... Choose my loadout. What do you want me to play? I pretty much got everything except for Excalibur Prime, Skana Prime, and uh, what's the other one? I don't remember what the other one was. There's another or secondary that I don't have. Or in primary. I don't remember. No? I don't know. So, Kiss, you got to make a decision now. You spent the cheddar. Now you got to let me unleash the cheddar, you know? <laughs> I should say, also, um, what I will be doing today is um, I still am not finished with getting uh, the things from this new Prime uh, unlock. So, if we look at my shit, I'm over here stroking my shit. I got lotion on my dick. I am done with Gauss Prime. That is building. Um, uh, this is also building. Seltra is done. But uh, the Acarius, I think I'm saying that right. Um, we have... I, I'm, I'm fucked. I'm fucked. I need Neo A11 relics and I need Lith A6 relics. So I'm probably going to spend some time farming that out. I do have... The barrel is done. The barrel is done. I need one more of the receiver and the blueprint. So um, I've been having a hell of a time though trying to get these relics. 
I've been I've farmed for like an hour before I started the stream, so um I had to take a break from this fucking kitchen over here. So play your favorite loadout, okay? <laughs> Kiss oh that, oh well, okay. That sounds fine. I forgot to get the relic packs from the syndicates until after I already farmed everything, so I have a bunch of extra relics. Kiss I don't I I I, I I'm not gonna ask you for them. I don't I think you should open them and try and sell them. I think you should do that. I think you can make some decent money. Or we can open them together if I get a relic. But I don't want your fucking handouts, okay? No. Um I appreciate it, but I, I don't uh I don't uh I don't yeah. Well let me get one. And then Here's the, you know what you wanna know what's fucked up, Kiss? Is I <laughs> I I've bought, I date as soon as the, uh, on Wednesday I bought all my, the relic packs. Actually, I could buy. Maybe I should buy another one of these. Actually, I bought relic packs. What do I need? What is it? I forgot what the hell the name of them was. Hold on. Yeah, I spent all the syndicate shit, I, including all the open world stuff, my main syndicates. I haven't bought Teshin's relic packs with Steel Essence. I bought all of them, and I still did not finish this shit. And I, I called it. I called it. I remember Grendel Prime came out. I didn't give a shit about any single thing, any Prime thing that came out. And I got all of it, like, in a matter of, like, maybe an hour or two. This... <laughs> Because I actually want all of three of these things. I want the primary, the secondary, and the frame. Uh, I'm just getting fucked in the ass. So, uh, yeah. Uh, okay. So, Neo. Okay, shit. It's not what I wanted. What are you curious about? Relic pack. Hmm, I see. XED5, I don't need that one. P8, H6. Okay, I don't need any of that. So... Yeah, it's bullshit. You know what I could do, actually, real quick? Let me visit Solaris and turn in that stuff real quick, because I can get, a, like, two relic packs from that, I think. Anyways, um, I had four syndicates max, a ton of medallions, all three open worlds max, and the max steel path packs you could buy. Yeah, uh, with, so, wow, you had four syndicates maxed. That's crazy. Did you get that Gauss? I, uh, I'm, it's building right now, Walker. Uh, I'm still trying to get the secondary, though. I, and I don't know if I'm saying it right. Acarius? Acarius? You know what? We're going to Google Translate. I don't give a fuck. Because I'm going to keep mispronouncing it until I... We're going to... Hold on. Chinese? Acarius. 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 I'm still after that one. Um, What was I going to do? I don't remember. Acarius. Okay. Let's go to this bitch. Let's go to this bitch. So anyways, that's what we're going to be doing today, though, is this. So, um... All this shit... Is just opening up relics and trying to farm out relics and shit, so... You know, hey, uh, if you are missing... I'm, I only need two more. Well, I'm probably going to be more than that, but uh, maybe I can maybe I can get that streamer luck. I, you know, I swear, maybe that that's what I can do, but I need Axie, or uh, wait, shit, no. With A6 and Neo A11. I need two A's. I got two A's. I got an A cup. You know what I'm saying? Um. Okay, we're going to go to Smoke Finger, which I want to know why that finger's smoky. You know what I'm saying? Oh. I suck your dick for you. I throw punch that bitch. Oh, okay. Uh, shit. Shit. Okay. All right. Two of these. Let's see. Did we get anything? T10. No. T10. Nope. Okay. Yeah. Bullshit. Waste of time. Uh, Akiris Prime is really strong, too. Yeah, I, I fucking love that weapon. I love the base version of that weapon. I always thought it was so fucking cool. It was not very powerful, though. Uh, I know that the base version, like, you know, not a lot of people used it. Uh, there's definitely some better guns in the game, but, uh, I'm hoping, I, I haven't looked at anything about the Prime one, uh, but I'm hoping it's great. So, um, okay. I don't know, I think I'm probably just gonna do, just probably solo it here, and I've just been doing Hepit over and over again. Just over and over and over again, so... 
Prime is a huge step up. I'm glad to hear it because that might be one of my main secondary weapons for for a while. Well, I uh, cause that weapon is very cool. So you're trying your hardest to get Endo. You know, hey Walker, I don't know if you're far into doing um, Railjack shit, but um, Railjack stuff is a fantastic way to farm Endo. Like a really fantastic way to farm Endo. After Gauss, I never want to touch Hoppet again. Oh, did you farm a shitload of uh, these relics for it? Uh, you know, uh, Apollo Lua, this mission, and the other one for the Mezzo and Neo relics on Void, I don't ever want to do ever again because of every single time uh, this shit. Uh, every single time there's a new Prime frame comes out, and I and I don't get it all after buying my relic packs and things like that. I uh, ha end up having to farm this shit out, so yeah, that pisses me off for sure. Just unlucky as hell. Yeah. Uh, well, uh, me too. I'm being... I'm un I'm probably... I'm not at a shitload yet, but I'm unlucky for sure. Very unlucky. C11. Bullshit. Don't want it. Dog shit. Chicken shit. Although, it's not bad though. Because doing this over and over again... Um... Does... Help. Right? For when you want to open relics and get some forma. You know, you, you're, you are, you're doing something that's going to benefit you. In the long run. Oh. Ooh. Uh, yeah, uh, a lot more farming to come. Oh. Sorry, I just said come and it just triggered me. Yeah, um, Zaku is going to be insane. I know, I think we got Protea first, right? And then Zaku, but dude, Zaku. I'm very excited for that one, actually. Like, I have not dumped a lot of time into the regular version of Zaku, because I, I don't want to. Because I, I just know that I, I'm just going to do it for the Prime frame, so... I'll save the experimentation with that one. But Protea is another one uh, that is, like, can be a decent, um, like, spot defense with the, with the little rocket slash things. Uh, which I have not built out either. I have Protea, I just don't have, like, a any forma in it or anything like that so he was out of I was out of forma until yesterday shit yeah you can never have enough I uh got kiss and I I think it was like last stream it might have been last stream we were just opening up relics for like fucking I swear to god it was like three hours straight and I got a shitload of forma from that just like 15 16 something blueprints like that so I've been good for a while and then opening up these relics there was a couple of them in the in the bunch that uh, had some forma in them, and uh, when I uh, didn't get the part that I was after, oh, is this it? Oh shit, it is, dude. Nice, hell yeah. When I didn't get the part I was after, you know, I, I chose the forma. So, um, I had 2k extra plat, so I said fuck it and bought a bunch of forma bundles. At, not bad. Did you? So, kiss. Did you end up selling stuff? You said that you wanted to farm out a bunch of these relics and stuff to to um, sell shit. And Kiss, do you want to <coughs> open up Lith A6 with me if you're there? I will invite you if you want that. If anyone else has Lith A6, which is for the Acarius Prime Receiver. Yes, Smetchel, how are you? Oh my god, today! Retribution! I suck your dick for you. Oh, sorry. I did. Sorry, that was not retribution. Hello. I just meant to say hello. Mm -hmm. Lick hi. Good chicken. Special hi. Retribution hi. Jerry hi. Hey, how are you? Whoa. Hey, how are you? Are you into drinking Gatorades? Specifically, cucumber flavor. Ew. Okay. Sorry. Um, have you ever played Starfield? Um, Starfield. What's the other one? Star Citizen. Have you ever played? St Starfield is the Bethesda game. Uh, no, I have not. I've I've seen. I've heard a lot that it is dog shit, though. I have heard that. Okay, Kiss, you're gonna bring me the streamer luck. I know you're streaming right now. You're no, he's not actually, but he's gonna bring me the streamer luck. Uh, okay. With a six, what do we got? We got this. Good. 
Uh, Retribution, uh, why is it dog shit? Listen, here, here's the thing. I've always kind of thought all Bethesda games are dog shit. And the one that I enjoyed the most was Oblivion. Because Oblivion was like, had that charm to it. You know, it's like, it was, you know, that early era. That early, you know, generation era. And where that, that it had that, uh, that charm to it. Even though it was kind of shitty. And then, uh, I, I don't, you know... As soon as Skyrim came out, I was, like, kind of disappointed. I was, like, I wanted this game to be so much more, and it just still feels like you're hitting everything with a wet noodle. So, uh, you know, fuck it. Okay, with a six... What did you say here? I'm not sure if I have... Oh, fuck. Oh, okay. All right, that's okay, Kiss. That's okay. I will... Thank you for letting me know that. Um... Save it. Hey, you know, you know, save it though. If I, uh, if I can't get whatever. Also, if you want to just, if we could just spend a shitload of time opening up relics again. You know, get a couple of forma. I hate it when people invite me to a game when I'm already doing, I'm already fucking hosting a thing here. Please, BB, come. Oh shit, I shouldn't have said come. Uh, uh, okay, I'm in an important quest. And I'm and it's soft locked. I'm in a space battle. My allies die immediately, and I just respawn into the battle. Oh, that's the bad thing about Bethesda saving shit, right? Like that, that you can. I that happened in uh, Fallout. Fallout Three for me. I remember uh, it was like the giant mutant things that like killed you real fast. And I remember I went through a door, and uh, I got like one shot immediately. I think I was already on low health. And uh, it's auto-saved right when that happened. And every single time I s started the game again, it would just happen with me going through the door and getting shot immediately. And so, yeah, I, I think I had to, like, lose a shitload of progress because I had to, like, go back so far. So. Um, find it easier to just filter? I just fucking let people message me. I just say, fuck it. I'm just lazy like that. But, um, yeah, I suppose you're right. Um... See, I just do that. Uh, listen, we were talking about um, we were talking about sex. No, we were talking about. Uh, oh man, I'm running low on void traces. That is not good. I'm running very low. Um, let me make sure. I gotta make sure. Here's the other thing. People try and fucking jerk you around here when you're opening up relics. I gotta see if uh, people are actually doing it. Okay, this person's got lith a six. A6 rad. A6 rad. A6 rad. A6 rad. Come on, you son of a bitch. Don't try and pull one over on old Jerry G. Okay, A6 rad. All right, we're all good. Um, There needs to be, like, some fucking system that, like, when these new relics come out, there needs to be something that, like, shows up to, like, ensure that people all use the same fucking relic. There should be, like, a, a menu thing that, like, shows up like this. And it's like you, everyone has to do the same like relic in order to like continue the mission. You know what I'm saying? Like this shows up on screen, like, you know, Hey asshole, if you didn't do this, then you fuck you, you got to get out. But here's the thing we were talking about this, right? That like, if you make it easier to open up relics, this is kiss. Kiss was saying this kiss was saying, if you make it easier to open up relics and get prime parts and things like that, or you simplify the system and somehow, it kind of loses the value of platinum in some way. So I don't know. I don't know if that would, if you think that method would happen. We're like, the thing is, is I just get annoyed because, hey, this prime thing just came out. Okay. The thing that you do in the game is you open up relics together. You open the same type of relic, like what we're doing right now. We're all opening up radiant versions of A6. Okay. But sometimes people will join your group and they'll do like, Oh, I'm just going to do an A4 one. They're not going to notice. And then like, okay, well, you're not doing the group fucking rules there. You're being a piece of shit is what you're doing. And you're fucking us up. Because now I have to fucking kick you or like reform the group. That's the other thing. Why can't you just kick anyone from your group? Why, why can't the party leader kick someone from the fucking group? No, they have to leave. And it's like, they could just be a troll and not leave. That's happened before. So, I don't know. That just pisses me off, though. Wait, that's not what I was saying. Well, no. I know I know you're talking about trading. But, 
maybe by having a system like that right would devalue the platinum you know like if you had something that showed up like okay everyone has to equip the same relic and there's like this like ui thing that pops up like this maybe that would maybe that would simplify the process too much to where the value of that new i don't know you know what i'm trying to say here it'd probably be fine i'm hoping it would be too um anyways something i think that could be improved right is something something about equipping relics just the whole equipping of relics and trying to do a rad share thing it's like it's such a commonplace thing to do especially in warframe as well so oh shit hold on fuck hold on hold on okay um nice um is relic trading worth it i've been doing uh uh, uh arbitration mods and former grinding on void wait RB mods and former grinding on void real jack is killing me um <clears throat> you're talking about trading the actual relics not the prime parts <coughs> oh my god why do i sound like a fucking horse's ass um okay i finished i'm gonna leaving that group and i didn't even say thank you um it can be yeah it can be i think most people that do buy relics though buy um vaulted ones oh like unlocking the relics not just rel wait what do you mean yeah oh yeah if, if that's what you're at yeah so if that okay wait actually if they if you didn't know about that let me try and break this down for you you probably already you you might already know about this if you already do stop me okay yeah, prime parts. You're so you open up you open up relics for prime parts. So let's let's use let's use Gauss for example. Let's look at um, Axie B7. Okay, uh, I want. Oh, you can't see my fucking shit. I'm over here stroking my shit. Okay, um, I want Gauss Prime. Okay, uh, we're gonna we're gonna open up one of these relics and attempt to get that. Okay, all right, I got it. I got Gauss Prime Blueprint. Cool. What do I do? Okay. Now what do I do? Is I go to the browser. Okay. And I type in www.pornhub.com. And I, and I stroke my shit real quick. Okay. I stroke my shit. Okay. And then after I get done stroking my shit. You know. I go to Warframe.market site. Gauss Prime Blueprint. How much is that selling for? 55 Platinum right there. Boom. All you got to do is make an account. And have people just message you. So yeah. It's, it is the, it's the best way to... Um, to make platinum what i do is i don't sell shit all the time what i do is i hoard it i hoard it like crazy and actually i have if you don't know what alka frame is i don't know if you're playing on pc or not but if you are playing on pc you should get alka frame and alka frame is not open so i have to open it yeah i yeah actually i agree with kiss on that one you can do hey you can hang out if you get what you could do is you could say to recruiting like hey does anyone want to open axie relics there's like a survival mission or a defense mission let's let's go do that together and you get a group and then you just do that i hate that shit i don't want to do defense missions i don't want to i don't want to do interception missions i don't want to do survival when it comes to opening up relics i do the fast ones i do exterminate sabotage capture rescue um all that stuff so yeah um anyways if you're on pc there's a really awesome add-on though and it's called um alka frame and what i do is i hoard all of my prime parts because i'm always trying to get forma but if forma doesn't drop then i'll just go whatever the highest platinum thing is but you can organize all this shit by 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 prime parts where is this prime parts and so i haven't or organized so like i mean if i wanted to i could probably make a bunch of money right now if i wanted to so i just list all this shit through this hang out in the dojo and sell a bunch of stuff and that's how i how that's how i make my platinum is this and then also going to um mods selling mods and shit as well so um you can make a lot of money uh saving up for ducats 
and going from going to Borrow Kateer and buying primed mods and hoarding them for a while until like the initial buyout of them all happens when people are listing them. And then uh, you can make a lot of money doing that too. Rivens. Rivens are another way, but uh, I don't fucking ask me for advice on selling Rivens because I've probably only ever sold like two in my entire fucking shit. It is PC privilege having Alka Frame. It is. But um, if not, you got to do it the manual way and just go to uh, go to this website or free market site. And you can choose Xbox, PlayStation, Switch. So, and sell shit that way. But... Think? I don't know if cross trade. Yeah, okay, cross trade is available now. So yeah, I don't think. I think if anything, list everything on the PC one now. I think that's like just like the standard. So. I mean, yeah, selling, but selling mods, that's not bad. I mean, that, I, I've made a lot of platinum doing that. So, um, you know, another thing you can do is you can do those, um, those, uh. Fuck, what is it? The, uh, I forgot, the Hall of Ascension. You can do, like, those Hall of Ascension missions, too, and sell those mods. Those actually sell for, they're not, like, the most, but, like, if you get, like, the, what is it, the uh, Ability Strength minus uh, Duration one, I forgot what that's going, what it's called, but uh, a lot of that shit sells decently. Um, and I think that comes from the little puzzles on Lua, so... That's true. Actually, yeah, Kiss has a, that's another good one. Is that um yeah, if you have your daily standing shit um from your main syndicates, you can you can do um yeah, you can sell these the augment mods or I've had luck with selling both the mods but uh uh ever so often people will buy the uh weapon parts as well is you know like corvus barrel or things like that because a lot of people they don't want they're like fuck i already ranked up my syndicates i don't want to have to uh shit i don't want to have to um you know re-rank a new syndicate and have to do all that shit so yeah um that's another thing fleeting expertise that one i think that is it yeah that's i think that's the one all of those mods though retribution that i just like those ones that you get from the hall of ascension puzzle things those can sell decently. They usually sell pretty fast. Um, uh, yeah. Actually, you know, our, you know, Tech, Tech who's in the stream ever so often, he says, um, uh, actually, wait, no, that's not what I was going to say. Never mind. That is not related to anything that I was going to say. Don't, uh, do disregard what i just said okay um i need now neo a11 let me make sure that i am actually done with uh what am i looking for here inventory <clears throat> acarius okay i got i need the blueprint why oh why didn't i take the blue pill um Okay, Neo A11. I always forget what the mission is called for Neo A11. Void Uko. Okay, that's it. Uh, there we go. Oh, yeah, Auric and Vaults. That's the other thing. Yeah, it, but uh, it's up to you if you feel comfortable holding, like, four Dragon Keys or if you got a group that you can open Dragon Vaults with and stuff. I do that stuff passively because if Nightwave asks for opening Hall of Ascension things or um, Dragon Vault things, that's how I get those mods mainly, and then um, I'll sell them that way once I once I sell everything together. But yeah. Um, but really, the best way probably, probably the most surefire and secure way is just opening up relics. Opening up relics, and then, hey, um, if you didn't know, you can, like, I don't know if you're on PC, but I don't know what it is on console, but you can, like, tab. If you press tab on the, uh, relic, it'll say vaulted or unvaulted, and you can actually ask in the recruiting channel, hey, looking to open up vaulted relics with a group of four people, and you can do that as well. So that way, you all have a chance to get, like, 
something relatively rare that will sell higher than than uh you know unvaulted relics if you were to get their prime parts it all depends though you know that's the other nice thing about alka frame too is if you if you're on pc and you have that add-on it'll actually tell you what relics you have that are the highest value so um i never really look at that though i just open up i pretty much only open up unvaulted relics i don't know why i just I like to hoard all the vaulted ones, and I, I tell myself one day I'll get a group going and we'll open up a bunch of vaulted things, but uh, I never do that, so I don't know. Okay, I was... What the fuck is the name of this thing? A11. Neo A11. Okay. So anyways, yeah. I need, I need to... I am... I'm not broke in platinum but i'm definitely getting to the point where it's like i, I should probably sell some things because i was sitting pretty at like a thousand two hundred or something like that and now i'm down to like 800 because i've been buying a bunch of stuff so actually i think no i think i had like a thousand five hundred but then i bought what was it i think it was the goth i bought the goth and oh oh whispers in the wall came out and i bought all the mods for platinum because I just was like I don't want to farm this because I'm I'd rather focus on <gasps> operation gargling that cock you know or operation gargoyle sorry I always forget the name of it <laughs> uh, 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 smells like chili in here um ship size directly represents dick size uh and mine's pretty small isn't it isn't it I have a very small ship I like to keep it I like to keep it like a like a snickers uh snack size you know candy bar Hey, guys, uh, probably not allowed to ask this question, but if you were going to compare your genitals to a uh, candy bar, what would you compare it to? Wait, wait, wait. She the wait is in the building. Pissing me off. It's cold out in space. It's it's okay. Yeah. Smack his face. Yeah, it is. Uh, if I was going to compare my um, wiener to a candy bar, um, I would compare it to uh, one Kit Kat. Kit Kat. Not not a full not not the four Kit Kit Kats. The just one Kit Kat. Okay. Tic Tac, a fun size Snickers. <laughs> <laughs> Three Musketeers. Now what size is that? Tootsie Roll? Nice. Tootsie Roll. <laughs> Three yeah, Rolos. Good. So good. <laughs> now my nipples are like like two Rolos, dude. I haven't had a Rolo in so long. Okay, how about this? Milk Duds or Rolos? Pretty much the same thing, but they're not the same thing. Rolos generally have a softer, chewier caramel. Milk Duds are a little bit uh, hard. Kind of hurt your fucking teeth. You know, so my nipples are like king size Twizzlers. Holy sh! Holy, holy fuck! I'm coming. Yeah, that makes me want a nut. Uh, because it's fucking cold. Yeah, or yeah. Wait, singular Hershey kisses. That's what you got for nipples, Jerry. You got good hairstyle. Thank you. I've been uh, uh, practicing a lot of joking lately. So um, that it increased my hairstyle. I've been practicing a lot of joking. It's funny because I haven't showered today. You know what I kind of want to do? I kind of want to stop the shampoo. Stop the conditioner. I want to stop all of the detergents. I want to stop using all that shit. I'm not even going to ask what, the, what that is. What joking is? Kiss, go ahead and look it up. Please, get back to me, alright? Would you? I would love it if you could get back to me on that one, alright? Uh, anyways, um, wow, wow, I'm an alien. Uh, no, joking is, um, what I need to be doing. So, Jerry is mewing face ma mask. Ma fi J Jerry is a mewing face maxer joke master. <laughs> hey, I just learned what mewing is. Can, uh, I, okay, I'm gonna try and describe it, but I would love it if someone could actually. Can you, um, correct me what it is? Let's go 
Oh shit. Time to take a detox from Warframe and hate my life in smite. I'll be lurking. Much love, big dick man. Oh, Walker, no, don't quit like that. You gotta get in the game. No, that's okay. Hey, take a break. But I hope I hope that I hope that he's not like burnt out. I hope he just means like a detox for like a couple of hours, not like for like a couple months. Walker's a Walker's a good man. We need Walker needs to be in here. Walker's a good man. It's Walker fucking GHST. Walker's Texas Ranger. I suck your dick. Oh shit. Big oh fuck. Oh uh, shit. The, uh, fuck. Yeah, okay. Dennis, you can stay. Yeah. Okay, you've been taking. Okay, you've been playing all day. Yeah, take a break, please. Take a break. Okay, but g I'm glad you were here. And I hope you get some platinum. Mewing is joking, but for your jawline. Okay, so mewing, I guess, is when you rest your tongue at the top of your mouth versus like just letting it just kind of sit there. And supposedly it's supposed to like increase your jawline or something like that. Uh, does it work? I don't know. Am I been? Have I been doing the right mission? Ooh. Jeez, Badlands. Oof. Oof. Stinks. Stinks like Sprite Cranberry and Domino's Pizza. Ugh. Jesus. Um. Should I be? Should I be mewing? I don't, I don't really understand what it does. It, so like, if I is that what is that what it is? Right? Is resting your tongue at the top of your fucking mouth what is it what do, what do i do how do i become a chiseled man how do i become an alpha chad how do i become big dick jerry i just chew gum with ice cold water i suppose i could do that you know hey i didn't know this i was looking at the back of uh gum i was looking at the ingredients in gum and i did not realize how much gum has aspartame in it like a lot like the same shit they put in diet Pepsi and diet Coke and diet everything diet right they have that in gum is aspartame did you know that I did not know that like extra orbit uh, what's the other one I don't even know that so you know hey I don't know all those fucking gums have aspartame in it I thought they just had sugar I don't know they were putting fucking sugar free bullshit in there Diet water. Yeah, I have diet water. Yeah, can I get a diet water? And can you bring it with the meal? With the meal. Pretty much, you gotta flex your jaw muscles a little and suck your cheeks in slightly while you do it. That's how... What the fuck are you talking... How do I do that? Let's look up a... Let, all right, let's look up a Jew... Let's... All right, fuck. Let's look up a mewing... <laughs> Let's look up Jewish tits. Let's look up Jew. Let's look up mewing tutorial. Mewing tutorial. Okay, we're gonna look, we're gonna watch this Chad. We're gonna watch this Chad do a mewing tutorial. Let's turn the fucking music off. King, if you want to improve your jawline, you might yes. want to try mewing. Yes. Even though it's still a little controversial, it's worked for me and it's worked for a lot of other people. Yes, and I want to have sex with you. I think it doesn't hurt to try. Yes. If you want to learn for yourself, here's a simple trick to learn yes. how to mew. Save these three simple steps. Yes. Step number one is to <coughs> smile and stack your teeth just like this. Step number two is to make the end noise. Mm. At the end of the noise, wherever your tongue is, that is where your tongue should be. Keep it there, and it should be fully on the top of the roof of your mouth. Step number three is to get in the habit of doing this throughout the day and even while you sleep. Good luck, King. You got this. Am I doing it? Am I doing it? Fuck. That's not what I'm... Am I doing it? I fuck this. It's fucking stupid. Fuck all that shit. I don't know. Just fucking go to the gym. Fat fuck. Sorry. Uh, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna do fellatio. Uh, what is fellatio? Does that mean sex or does that mean, uh, fellatio is the act of simul stimulating a man's penis with the mouth. Oh!
Whoopsie! É isso aqui, ó. And the tongue thing, pretty much. Okay, so well, so am I cute then? Hey, listen, I got a pretty chiseled jaw. Except for I'm starting to get a double chin. Jerry, can you do a meme review? I left one in the meme section on Discord. Okay, all right, let's see. Uh, I, can't let suck it. I think I know. I think I know what this is. I'm kind of scared. Hold on. Need a smoke. It's okay, smoke. mom. Don't worry about it. Fuck. The smoke. No, you don't need a fucking smoke, you old bitch. Hey, fucker. Fuck are you? <sighs> <laughs> Eat a smoke. It's, it's smoke. okay, mom. Don't worry about it. Fuck. The smoke. No, you don't need a fucking smoke, you old bitch. <laughs> hey, fucker. Fuck are you? <sighs> oh, it's like kind of offensive. <laughs> but kind of awesome, you know, at the same time. Um, that's awesome. Yeah, that's great. What the fuck is this? What the fuck happened? Someone shit the bed? Bruta, bruta, bruta. I can't understand a word of it. All right, anyways, sorry. Um, it's okay. Are we there? Are we still live? Am I lagging? Oh boy. Am I lagging? Are we there? Being offensive over there. Okay, um, I do have to warn you guys. For some reason, the bitrate and shit is all over the place. And I don't think... My lights have been flickering all day. And it's still... All of the snow is still, like, melting. And, um... It's definitely causing a ruckus, causing mud out there. You know what I'm saying? Fuck. God damn it. Hold fuck on, where off. is it? Oh, fuck. Oh, shit, where is it? Oh, no. It didn't save my sounds. Holy oh, fuck! fuck. <laughs> Chinese, like Chinese, me. Oh. Fuck me! I didn't save my uh, my uh, causing a ruckus, causing mud. Shit. Anyways, um, my lights have been flickering all day, and I uh, really don't know if my power is gonna go out or not. I'm I feel like it's gonna happen, and my internet keeps going out too. So, I I, I don't even think this stream is working right now. Is it working? Hello. Are we there? If you missed what I said, the internet's being fucky. So, it's being real fucky. It's being fucky wucky. Just like how uh, Kiss said earlier, it was fucky wucky. The servers were being fucky fucky. Jerry's in, Jerry in 20, 240p. Fuck, really? That's not good. Oh, I don't even know why it's happening though. I don't know why that's why that occurs. It's annoying though. So, oh, am I back? Am I there? I don't know how to. Maybe it's just the internet. Maybe I should fix something. Do something. I think we're good. It says we're good. It says we're good on my end. I'm getting warm. I'm getting toasty. I'm getting spicy. That's like a hot sriracha. Sriracha hot chili sauce jelly. The bugs got into your internet too. Dude, that would suck. Dude. That would suck. Have you seen... Uh, I remember actually there was um, a guy. I saw this thing. Who... Um, <clears throat> He worked at uh, Best Buy. He worked at the uh, at Geek Squad. So he would often, you know, fix computers, right? That's I think that was the main thing. Like, hey, if you got a virus, they'll reform. If you don't know shit about computers, bring your shit to Geek Squad and you got to 
team of fucking stoner ass like kids fixing your shit and um I remember hearing a horror story that um someone brought in I think a laptop and someone brought in an Xbox and a laptop and there was like a whole hive of spiders living in like the Xbox and then like some like I don't know what there was and some like moth infestation in like uh in the computer thing so yeah close your door hey ma close the door you're letting the Wi-Fi out stupid bitch huh hey grab a smoke get a smoke Hey, I'm Ray, and I quit fucking smoking with fucking Chantix. Thank you, Ray. You know, it's been a long time since we heard from Ray, and I'm good. it's good to see him. Stream cut out at the f perfect time? I don't even know what happened. Fuck. Shit. Um, <laughs> I hope it doesn't... I hope my power doesn't go out, but things have been weird. And, okay, the bitrate's fucked up again. <laughs> bitrate's fucked up again. So, that's not good. Might have to lower the bitrate even more, so... God, it's like you think I'm gonna blame this on the weather and not my internet. I hope it's not I hope it's not my internet. Hello? I think we're good. Yes. Okay. Um I analyzed the stream and there was something about like a hardware accelerated GPU setting in Windows 10 that uh I don't know. I disabled it, and hopefully, I don't know. I don't even know if that was it, but I think we're okay. Uh, you got to give me a second though to set everything up here. So I got to reset up the soundboard. I got to get Discord going. I got to get everything going here. So, um, I have no idea. I have no idea. I think we're good though. <laughs> Fuck. It's gone, oh, gone. This is this is you can hear all that? Bye, da, da, da. Hey, bitch, I'm back. Oh, I'm hungry. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Un momento, por favor. Brazers. Not that. That's not what you want to see. That's what you want to see. Google. Google Press. Um, okay, what else am I missing? Oh, the video game. How about that? That's what I probably should log in to play that. Okay, I don't know. Maybe it was just the hardware. Ex I don't even what the, what, what the fuck did I disable? My internet the entire time was fine. Uh, it, like, literally just a problem with OBS. I don't know. It might honestly be time to do Streamlabs or something, but then you got a whole other host of problems over there. I've heard m many complaints about Streamlabs, and it would take me so fucking long to transfer everything over to there. Um, I don't know. Let me see something here. Let's 
Sorry, that is not what I meant to do. Um, <laughs> we'll get with the show soon. What up, bro? Uh, what's up, dude? We're having one hell of a time over here trying to fucking figure out OBS. So, um, sorry for the <laughs> fucking bullshit. <laughs> Like five different live streams that I just started now. Um, we're back. We're back, though. I think we're back. Give me a couple more seconds. I'm sorry. There we go. Oh, guzzle. Drink, 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 no, chin action. Done! Done. Whoa. No, signing off, signing off. I'm so happy I can drink beer with my family. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I tell you, difficulties in my life is just, it's, it's the... Fried chicken is, is always overpriced on Fridays, but not on Sundays. Yeah! Oh, dude, dude, this is like the first guy to understand me. I just get it, though, because I've been there before. I've been to... Can you guys just do some crazy shit? Um, wow. Fried chicken is overpriced. You know what? This, this will cause a grown man to drink. You know? Woo! Um, hey, uh, now that we're back to our regular programming, I'm sorry for that. Okay, I am. I, I want to talk to you about something. I had a New Year's party, okay? And, uh, yeah, I know, it's, yep, it, it's been, been a couple, again. yeah, exactly. It's been a couple, uh, uh, you know, days since New Year's, but, um, I did have a New Year's party, and, uh, something I said was bring your own booze, you know, bring, bring something you'd like to drink. Or if you want to share, bring something. And a lot of people brought a lot of alcohol. And I just saw the lights flicker. So, um... I'm sorry if the power goes out or something happens. Uh, this stream has just been a fucking roller coaster. Anyways, a lot of people brought alcohol over. And I still have a lot of alcohol in my fridge. And... Check Dio brought a shitload of beer. Just piss beer. But then also brought over something... That I thought... You brought over monster energy drink alcoholic beverage. It's called Beast. Now, there is no caffeine in this. There's no energy. There's no guarana. This, let me read the back of this for you, okay? Let me read the back of this. Our original crew has been making drinks for 30 plus years now. Our favorite brand, Monster Energy, is about to turn 21 years old. We figured why not celebrate the big day by making an adult beverage. We hit delete on the energy blend, cut out the caffeine, and ditch the sugar. What does this say? Next, we brewed up the smoothest tasting alcohol ever and blended. Blended it with our tried and true flavors. The beast is unleashed. Great taste, 6 point oh my percent alcohol and no sugar to weigh you down <clears throat> get ready to celebrate and don't be afraid of the big bad beast cheers you might be thinking to yourself ew when i saw these i thought ew this is looks disgusting this looks like a heart attack and oh my god was i so wrong this legitimately is out of all the shitty like fucking like stupid flavored alcohol tasting things you can get like bud light seltzer and all that stuff this is awesome this tastes legitimately really fucking good and it does not taste like alcohol at all i also had the fruit punch one which is like the red can i think it's called like berry punch or berry blast or that ass or some shit i don't know what the fuck it's called it's fucking good this is very good unironically this is very good Obviously, it tastes like cancer in a can because it's just like tastes like I mean, there's like What is in this? I don't know what the Sugar substitute that they used but I mean first of all, it's six percent and this one specifically the cum flavored one the white one 
was really good. It tasted like fucking Mountain Dew. I didn't know Mr. Beast made four loco. <laughs> the Beast. Yeah, these are good. I don't even know if you can buy these anymore. But if you are into flavored bullshit alcohol stuff, that you should give this a shot. There's like an assorted pack. It's not bad. Check Dio. You're crazy. See the snap finish? You're crazy for bringing this over, and I'm sorry for ever doubting you. Bang! This is very good. This was very good. It was very good. I should probably join... Shit. Hold on. Yeah! yeah. Uh, my mic is all fucked up. Anyways, um... Yeah, no, the, yeah, the, um... It's unleashed. Just like my ass is about to be. Uh, 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 yeah, um... Wh uh, wh why was I drinking? Um, I tried all the flavors and only like the first three gulps. Oh, really? Okay, well, I don't know. This one was good. I liked it. I liked all of them. Here's the thing. After that, it was kind of bad. Oh, making me feel bad. Oh, shit. Okay, well, I don't know. I could be wrong. Um... I enjoyed it. Uh, so uh, here's the thing. It, you know, we, we've had a couple snow days here. And um, I worked out at home and I cooked and cleaned and stuff. I did that. Thank you, Jumble Crumble. And then, uh, you know, old live Easy Bill, she was stuck with me the whole time. I finally got her home today. I made it through the slushy ice and got her home. That was scary, though, driving. But anyways, she was here for since, like, Friday and left today. So, um... I don't know, we, you know, we just been, we don't really drink when we're together. We just kind of eat food and snacks and just be little fat kids at heart. But all of a sudden, you know, I was on my computer, she was doing homework and I, and she was like, you ever get the urge to just drink? And, and I was like, God damn it. Every single day. Uh, you know, listen, I used to be a pretty big alcoholic. Okay. I used to drink a lot, like a bottle of wine and like two beers afterwards. I, I used to drink a lot. And, yeah, I would love to just drink all the time. But it's a lot of calories. And I just don't need to be doing it all the time. And when she asked me that, I was like, God damn it, yes. I would love to drink. And she's like, you want to do that tonight? I was like, well, are you? don't tempt me. So we had a bottle of champagne that I had in the fridge. And then uh, I drank half of it. She drank half of it. She went to sleep. And then I just kept drinking. I kept drinking beer. I had one of these bad boys, and then I had the fruit punch one, I, and here's the thing, by the time I had the fruit punch one, I was already pretty toasty, and I was like, you know what? This is pretty fucking good. So I don't know if it actually was any good, now that you're saying that. I could have I could have just been drunk, but um, it tasted good. The This cum flavored one, I was a little less drunk when I had this one, and it was pretty good. It was pretty good. Anyways, um, I love drinking. I hate it. I hate drinking, but I love it. Women love it when you beast through a snowstorm. I don't know why me and my buddy drove 40 minutes and with a couple girls in the back. They got like so horny. Wow. Damn, Max. I suck your dick for you. Wow. I mean, I just took her home, but I didn't get I didn't I didn't receive any. I suck your dick for you. You know, I just got her home, but I also enjoy the default flavor of 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 monster. Uh, I, I I'm more of a Red Bull guy. I gotta say, I do love Red Bull. So, anyways, so yeah, that was my alcoholic story. Uh, I would love to crack open that thing and drink it, but I I don't need to be drinking. God, I would love to drink though. Right now, I would just fucking slam down a couple of beers. <sighs> I can pound them away like nobody, like no one else. My blood is 90% piss beer. Red Bull gives you AIDS. I have AIDS. I have AIDS. I love AIDS. Anyways, no. I mean, probably, but I don't, yeah. Probably diabetes, honestly. Um, okay, I still fucking need, I still, I, I was bar barely got any relics from that. So I still need Neo A11, I think. I think I still do. I think I do. Let me see here. I don't think I got one. Yeah. Also, I hope um, I, I changed the setting in OBS, and I, hopefully there's not a horrible delay. If Tell me if there's a horrible delay, though, because um, I would like to know. I'm not sure. 
Red Bull gives you AIDS. I think I can make one rad relic. Okay. Um, I have... I can make two more rad relics. So, I still need to get the fucking thing. But, um, yes. Yes, that sounds good. And I suppose I can switch over to Wukong now at this point. Probably should do that. So I can finish this mission faster. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh, yeah, daddy. Um, I'm in a piece of shit, though. Um, uh, okay, you got one uh, A11? Okay, if you want to hold on to it and wait for me, you're welcome to. I don't know how long it's going to take me, though, to get this fucking thing. Um, so it's pretty... Um, it's pretty unreliable getting relics from this in this mission. <laughs> Thank you, Crackhead. That's Crunk Coco. Look him up on YouTube. Crunk Coco's got a lot of great content. Um I got into a mission with four 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 goosies. You got four goosies in your thing? You love this new little crackhead one? Yeah, I, I... Actually, can I say, that was probably the easiest channel point I've ever made. That was that was probably the easy... I, like, listen, I put that shit into After Effects and I rotoscoped Crunk Coco. And it rotoscoped, like, immediately. I didn't even have to do anything. I didn't even have to fix anything. Like, th some of these other ones... Like, uh... Like, where is this one? Like, this one... That one took, this one took me a really long fucking time to make. That took me a long time to edit that fucker out. That young Jerry out. And, uh, that jailbait Jerry out to, to, to use it as a channel point. Crunk Coco, Crunk Coco came right out. Crunk Coco was ready to come out. Come on, Crunk Coco. It's clean young Jerry. I don't know about clean. I definitely was not clean, but yes, you're right. A cleaner young Jerry-o. Jerry-o. Cheerio. Jerry-os. I used to have that helmet hair. I still kind of do have that helmet hair. You just can't tell because I'm wearing a, the headphones, but... Oh, I mean, I still have helmet hair. I still do. I got, uh, I got a coconut head. You guys remember Coconut Head from Ned's The Classified School Survival Guide? Gotta love that show. Show was great. I should download that show. I mean, I should legally buy that show and watch it because I paid for it and spent money on it to watch it. There's no way I went to a specific website to stream it for free. I definitely paid for it. I definitely pay for everything that I consume there's i've never stolen anything in my entire life i've never used a website called pirate bay i don't even know what that website is that just those words just came to my head i've never looked at boners on the internet i've never watched gay porn before I've I've never gotten on my knees, prayed to a Catholic god, and jerked off to gay porn before. I've never done that. I've never been to Disneyland. I've never left my kids. I don't even have any kids, but I've never neglected a child support payment, and I've never taken them to Disneyland and left them in the line to wait for Star Wars The Force Unleashed while I go back to the hotel room to jerk off to gay porn. I've never done that before. I've never even seen another man's wiener. I've never jerked off to gay porn. Okay. Um, uh, uh, now, Jerry was a longboard wheels on a skateboard kind of guy. Yeah. <laughs> what? No, I tried to skateboard. I never, I never, I was not, I was not a skater kid. I was not. I definitely had a moment though there for a while where I was. I remember Bark Bark was, was skating. Our other friend was skating, you know, when we were we were going around hitting up the towns, but I never did any tricks. I just I just kind of did the skating. I just did, you know, like to ride around. But uh, I don't know. I biffed my cheddar pretty fucking hard, and I got scars still um, all over my body from it. And I because I hit like a rock, and uh, I uh, you know hurt myself, so I kind of stopped. I was like, you know, hey, skateboarding. 
Skateboarding's really cool. I don't know if you've ever watched skateboarding footage and just tricks and shit. It's awesome. It's fucking cool. I love watching that stuff. It's very addicting. But skateboarding is kind of stupid. I have to say it. It's kind of stupid. What a stupid sport. Like, how scary of a sport. You know, at least with surfing, like... I mean, surfing, you could die by sneaker waves or whatever. But, like, surfing is like, you know, you're not going to, like, fucking biff your cheddar so hard. You're like, I don't even know. Anyways, skateboarding is stupid. It's cool, though. Guys, uh, skateboarding always reminds me of this video. Let's check this video out real quick. Except for this video does have something offensive in it. So if you're offended easily, close your ears. time for crackheads that's a good bail on film though but you want to know what happened is this damn ass rock don't you just hate when that happens see look look you got thrown off your board see the skid mark you made with the rock and then here's the damn ass fucking gay damn ass rock <laughs> you want to keep it and pee on it no i want i want to live you can live but do you want to keep the rock and pee on it oh wait <laughs> oh Oh, oh, it's right here. Okay. You want to do something gay to the rock, like pee on it? Because that rock is effing ruined your line. But I got an effing good bail on it, huh? Why would, that, why would uh, nature do that to me? That's uh, stop videotaping me? Okay. Do you want to keep the rock so you can do something gay to it? <laughs> like pee on it. Yo, I got a question. Can someone taxi me to Kuva Confrontation if I don't have a level 5? Oh, shit. Uh, no. Uh, Alonzo. Alonzo, only someone who has a lich also ready to be confronted can taxi you to the mission. Um, what I recommend, though, I don't know if you've already done this. I think it's, what, the Saturn Proxima? Just put yourself to public. And just click on the mission, and you should be able to join a crew. You should be able to just join a crew, Alonzo, by just, like, just clicking on the mission. Just make sure you're on public. Because, um... Exactly. Because of that. Um... Yeah. Unfortunately, though, someone can't tax you to the Railjack mission unless they also have a lich that is ready to be confronted. So, um... I would do that for you, but I don't have a fucking thing. So, yeah, but there should be always... Oh, thank you for following. That's me shirtless in my kitchen punching a jello cup. So I hope you appreciate that. You better appreciate that. Um, oh, fuck. I thought the stream just froze. Um, you... Yeah, just... There should be always a crew going, though, and in, in confronting a railjacks. And if not... Ask in the question or uh, recruiting thing. Actually, probably not the recruiting one because it's so crazy right now, but maybe question and answers. Although someone's probably going to get mad at you like, Oh, go ask in the recruiting channel. You stupid. What, uh, don't, why are you asking for help in the question and answers thing? Go to the recruit. Shut the... F Just tell them shut the fuck up. Tell them shut up. Tell them they're being an asshole. And tell them to get off the fucking game and touch some grass. You can filter the recruiting channel. You can do that. Yeah, but I doubt anyone's... I doubt other people are doing that to help people with railjack stuff. So, I, I don't know. But maybe. You know, shit. I don't know. But you can filter. You can do that. I never do that. But you can do that. How do you do that again? Oh, yeah. This. Filter text. And then you do that. Anyways... Yeah, um, if you're enjoying this content, you fuck you, you know? I throw punch that bitch! No, I'm just kidding. Um, <clears throat> I'm not. Anyways, yeah, that video is from a different era. Let's see, that was, um, I probably don't know what the original... I don't know what the original video when that was released, but... 
What do you guys think about Ice Spice? You think that's an industry plug or not? What do you guys think about industry plugs? Do you know what an industry plug is? Industry, or sorry, industry plant, not plug. Industry plant. I think it's defined as someone, an artist, typically in music, who acts as if they are an independent creator or an independent label, etc. But they are actually backed by a label. But that that's that's what they have like a whole thing behind them. Like they're part of like a big, you know, industry. But they pretend like they're a part of like a grassroots thing. So uh, the example is Ice Spice, Lord. Um, I think even Justin Bieber. Um, probably not now, but like early Justin Bieber. Um, what is that? That K-pop band that I don't remember the fucking name of. I don't listen to any musicians that would do that. I don't fucking know either. But hey, we got a Neo A11. Nice, finally. I don't either. But um. I don't even know who the fuck Ice Spice is. I think I only I know that one song because it's probably all, all over social media, but I don't even remember what it is. Baby got my heart beat bumping away. Come on, crackheads. Um. Yeah, I don't know. Industry plants. <laughs> the weird thing about Ice Spice is that she had two songs. Two songs, and then all of a sudden blew up. Do you think Crunk Coco was an industry plant? Yes, definitely. Let's look at Crunk Coco and see if, uh... Let's see if Crunk Coco is still doing shit. Yeah, eight months ago. Let's look at this. I mean, that's not... We got one month ago. Let's see, what's... what's... I'm gonna turn this music off, but... <laughs> Crunk Croco getting it. Crunk Croco. Crunk Croco cute as shit. <laughs> I don't want to get copyright struck for this fucking bullshit, but Crunk Croco's doing it. Is the interview with Crunk Croco? Now I'm going to be in the arena performing this song, so I ain't even expect all from one song. Yeah, and um, how, you said you've been pushing the song for like two years now. Yeah, I've been pushing the song for two years now. So, if you believe in something, you know, keep pushing, keep pushing until everybody. Anyways, that's awesome. I'm glad Crunk Coco is um, living the best life. Okay, Neo, A11. Neo! Morpheus and Neo are sucking dick. Oh, shit. He's beginning to believe. The blow. You know what I just realized is, um, maybe I shouldn't say this. Is it weird how many, like, you think I just have like one too many things with like black people in it? <laughs> I kind of just realized how many... Is it offensive? See the snap finish? Is this offensive? Pissing me off. Bitch, you ain't no nerd. Went out on the porch. Smoked a bag of meth. Then I smoked a little Bitch, crack after that. No way. Come on, crack it. Is, this... <sighs> is this maybe too... Is this too much or... Can I just real... I'm kind of just realizing this. Oh brother, this guy stinks. It's okay, right? We're okay. Uh what what well what that's like four, yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Alright, never mind. Don't pay any attention to that. Okay. Um Uh, alright, Neo A11. 
probably Neo and what I just said is shouldn't be that close to each other. But um, anyways, let's go. Uh, what are we doing? Um, Neo A11. We're doing Rad Share. Uh, Harmon, are you still there? Kiss. Kiss. I know you're there. <laughs> I'm going to invite Harmon. I'm going to force him. Anyways, um, just a thought, just a thought. Oh, wow, you guys are just there. Okay, all right. The OA, oh shit. I'll do that. How do you know? How do I know what? What do we have to do? Do we have any good missions for this? We have a spy mission. Man, that I want to do something. I want to pee on that. All right, we're going to do a spy mission. It's going to be faster. It'll be the fastest. Hey, Jerry, we should do a review of the comment section on the last Thursday stream. We should. We will do that. Let me, let's do this mission, and then I will do that. Um, yes, we, hey, there are more updates on the Ben Shapiro vs. Destiny uh, <laughs> stream we did. <laughs> um... No oh, fuck. Uh, yeah, we have great things on that. Um, hold on. Am I getting any bites on this? Spy mission. Spy. Spy versus spy. Lord Ming Hu, bad news. No. We're in trouble. Um. This chat is actually moving quite slower today than I'm gonna invite the, fuck this guy I'm gonna invite him fuck you I'll do the same thing I don't even know if that was the same guy that invited me but I'm gonna do it to him fucker fucking bitch fucking asshole don't fucking invite me to something dickhead don't invite me to shit bitch I'm just kidding you can invite me to things but Hey, I think I left my spoon over there. Um, watch, 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 watch. Yeah, boom. Yeah, and that's annoying, isn't it? Imagine you're trying to host a group and then someone fucking invites you. Fucker. Boom. Fuck them up. Yeah, they declined it. Fuck you. Uh, anyway. <laughs> so, anyways, how's it going? How are you? Get fucked. That's right, nerd. That's right, nerd. Actually, um, I will say this. I have played a little bit more of that Project Ascension, that WoW class, uh, private server. Guys, you gotta check it out, dude. It's good. Oh man, I am not gonna get this blueprint. Sorry, I shouldn't go into. I shouldn't be negative like that. I just, it's. I just have a feeling. Because they're all good. I trust you. What's this guy doing? Let's see. It's like a habit for me to be like a fucking Nazi when it comes to this thing. Okay. This dude is... Oh, shit, he is. Yeah, he is. What are you guys? 29, 27? You guys are up, you guys are up there, too. I can't believe I'm not four yet. It's because I never uh, leveled up that arc gun. <laughs> I still need to do that. Maybe if I can get this fucking thing built tonight. Motherfucker tried to take my BFD Twilight Cultist rubs tonight in a BFD raid. That sounds fucked up. You play, uh, Max, are you playing Seasons of Discovery? How is that? Are you enjoying it? Are you enjoying that? And my stream just broke again, so... Okay, no it didn't. I gotta say, it does look fun. I'm enjoying the fuck out of it. That sounds cool. Is Did they change the level cap? Is it still 25 or what? Paladin Warlock? Sounds like you can kind of mix and match. Max, I know you would never play a private server. 
I know you never would. But if you ever don't want to pay for World of Warcraft, but you still want to play it, you really should check out Project Ascension. I'm, it's not illegal. You're not going to get in trouble for playing it. Nothing wrong is going to happen to your main account on Blizzard. You know, make a whole new thing and new login and all that. But it's it's a lot of fun. It's very cool. You spy. I know. It is, but this is the fastest mission we had available. This was the fastest mission we had. Seen those ads on Facebook? It's legitimately actually pretty good. I'm not going to lie. I mean, it's definitely not the same. And it's definitely not the same, you know, wow that you're used to. But it is cool. It's cool. But hey, here's the thing. If you're already paying for wow, just, just keep paying for it. Whatever. You know, I just don't want to pay for the game anymore. So I'm choosing to be a uh, Jabbat Shalom about it. So. La 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 la. Take a look at my girlfriend, girlfriend, she's the only one I got. Boo -doo -doo -doo, boo -doo -doo -doo. You guys remember that song? Not much of a girlfriend, girlfriend, I never seem to get a lot. Da -da 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 -da. You guys know? No? Remember that one? Already invested. Same with David, he won't play it yet. I'm gonna have to carry his ass. That's, hey, carry his ass. Gym Class Heroes, baby. Is that the name? Is that who does that song? Is Gym Class Heroes? I, there was that other song, too, that's like, I can be green, I can be blue, I can be everything, but I can be... You know that song? I forgot who does that song. Good, good song, good long cock. I love a good long cock song. Take a look at my penis, penis. It's the only one I got. boo doo 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 not much of a penis, penis. Uh, what is the... Oh, shit. What is the best option to put clan trade tax as? Oh, shit. Hold on. We didn't... Of course, we didn't get the shit. We didn't get jack shit. We didn't get jack shit. Um, what is the best option to put clan trade tax as? I have it as 0%, but apparently I should add a tax because people are using our clan. I know nothing about clans because I have been a... Um, follower i've been i've just been uh that's grace kelly that is grace kelly by mika it is cupid's chokehold is the song title what i'm getting different things here um i mean zero sounds like you're like you're a pretty fucking cool ass clan you know you got zero percent and like you know you're just going in there just doing shit I mean, that sounds pretty cool but um, I mean, I don't know. I, cause I, I've, I don't own a clan. I'm not, I, you know, I'm just like a, I'm just a guy. I'm just a guy in a clan, just like <laughs> hanging out, stealing shit. I'm like, you know, I'm in there just using all their shit. So, I mean, I don't know though. Be like a 2%. Yeah, I was going to say like 2 or 3%. But if someone trades an item for ten thousand, then they they need to pay a thousand if it, if if I make it ten percent. I mean that's a lot. I mean I think a lot of people, a lot more people will respect you probably for putting it at zero. But I would do something like lower. I mean, three percent, two percent, something like that. But nobody does like taxes. Ten percent, though, that seems a little extreme. I have to say, TNT, that seems a little extreme. Rayon, I hope I am saying your name. Rayon, Cupid's chokehold is the song title. Is that? Act what? Let me look this up. Cupid's chokehold. Patrick Stump. I'm not even gonna be able to play this song. Oh shit. Is this like the original song? Oh, wait. Oh, this is gym class here. Okay, I see what you're saying here. I thought the song... Okay, the band is gym class heroes. The song is Cupid's Chokehold. You know what? I'm going to favorite this song here. I'm going to bookmark this actually for... I should listen to that song. I'm going to listen to that Grace Kelly song too. Grace Kelly by Mika. I... 
used to fucking know all the words of this song, and I don't know, I don't know why I did. I think it was just on the radio. I, you know, I was, you know, hey, sailors, hello, excuse me, um, you know what I'm saying. So, um, what's three percent of ten thousand? I don't fucking know. Let me see. Uh, I need a calculator for that because I'm fucking stupid. So, times point uh, zero three, right? Three hundred. 300 would be that tax. I'm a stupid idiot. 30% would be 3,000. Rayon! Thanks. That said it for me, so I didn't have to say it. But I'll say it again. Thank you. You I make you make me want to blow. You know what I'm saying? You make me want to just fucking shoot. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to fucking nut. <laughs> so I appreciate you following. Um. Uh. What was I doing? Okay. Shit. I didn't get jack shit. I didn't fucking tickle my own dick. I didn't do shit. Oh wait. We're gonna review these comments. I think. Hold on. I got diarrhea. Like coming out my fucking ass. Excuse me. What? Huh? Let me see what's going on. Um, bro was complaining over an extra 300. Someone's complaining in your clan about fucking taxes. Some trades cost millions. Also, some people trade dozens of items a day. That's the other thing, too. Um, it, I think it depends on the item rarity and value right and that'll determine how expensive something is for the tax of it so oh diarrhea no i was having i just shit my pants um and they can always just go to another clan for zero that's true they can't i don't know what my clan is there a way to check that does this tell me what percentage are taxes at? This is probably like a crazy tax. Oh, I have to go to the trade post. Well, I'm not going to do that right now. I don't really care. I'm rich, bitch. I got 17 million fucking credits, baby. I'm I'm rich. I'm fucking rich. I don't give a fuck. You know what I'm saying? Oh, fuck. Shoot out air right at you. Ah. Oh. That's what I'm all about. I'm all about Tiffany. Easing down on that. Probably smells like a grater cheese. Okay. What was I going to do? Oh, yeah. All right. Hey, guys. So, a um, couple streams ago, um, Check Dio, my brother, came into the stream and was talking about um, how Ben Shapiro is going to do, like, a live debate with this popular streamer. His name is Destiny. I know nothing about either of these two people. It was just something he mentioned. Uh, I mean, I know who Ben Shapiro is. I don't know who Destiny is. Whatever. I don't care about politics. Sorry, I don't. Maybe you. Maybe that makes me uh, offensive somehow. I don't know. It. Whatever. You can be mad. Um. But we were just joking around about Ben Shapiro, just like, and we were just joking around about the debate and things like that that they were gonna do. So, anyways, um, uh, the stream ended. I was still in Discord with Check Dio, and I was asking Check Dio. I was like, what should we name this archived stream? Because every stream gets archived. Uh, right up there on the YouTube channel. That's right. You can go to YouTube and type in GJ Jerry G and see every single goddamn archive and including guides for Warframe on the YouTube channel. <laughs> so, um, anyways, so I named this stream, the archive of this stream was episode 140, Ben Shapiro vs. Destiny 2024 in South America. Just a, you know, silly title, you know? And we did, in fact, discuss how they were going to do the debate so it's not like it was misleading or anything so anyways i uploaded this video you know it's got um you know you know the title there and uh you know it's about five hour stream is what we did i put a little time mark here about when we start talking about ben shapiro versus destiny discussion and um let me just show you real quick here hopefully you can see um you know most of the live streams don't get a lot of views so, um, 
you know, you can see like girl tries Warframe for the first time. That one's got 169 videos, probably because it has girl in there. You know, this episode eight has 52 views. Okay, but like a majority of the views uh, for most of these live streams are about, you know, they're like they're 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 small. And that's okay. I expect that. You know, they're the mostly the archives are for me. But anyways, this one, Ben Shapiro vs. Destiny, four thousand six hundred and forty seven views. Okay? So that's gone up. Last stream, I think it was at two thousand. So let's look at some of the comments here on this. Alright. Imagine being a ten viewer Andy and discovering slime ball tactics. <laughs> Imagine being a 10 viewer Andy. <laughs> I love that. That's hilarious. Literally, literal, literal, not literally, literal most scummy form of clickbait. 11 likes on that one. The, uh, imagine 10 being being a 10 viewer Andy. That's got 7 likes on there. Um look at this guy. This guy, you do realize I'll just dislike this and press the do not recommend option, right? Let's look at the replies. Where is the do not recommend button? <laughs> and then how about this one? It's the not interested button appears on the videos to watch next, which this one was not in the actual video. Disliked and reported. I downvoted this one. I just felt like it. So, um, first of all, I cannot be reported for anything because I didn't do anything wrong. We do, in fact, talk about Ben Shapiro vs. Destiny. I'm not misleading them. I'm j that's just the title. It's just, just talking about it, you know? If you look at the title of my other things, a lot of them are about that. This one's titled T-Bone Steak. Because we watched that guy sing about T-Bone Steaks. Goodbye 2023. That was the, the stream right before New Year's. Hello 2024. That's the stream right after New Year's. Okay? Catholic sensualism. Okay? Yeah, we talked about Catholic gay sex. Yes, we did. Okay? Mary Crimbus from Jerry G. Yeah, that's fine. Okay? Barely legal company. We played legal company that stream. Okay? So it's okay. It's okay. They can't report shit. Go ahead, try, stupid bitch. Anyways, thought that was funny though. Um, there's more comments. Is there more comments than that one? Are they sh not showing me? Uh, let me see. Um, newest first. <laughs> whoa! I didn't. Whoa! What? I didn't see this one. You genu genuinely look afraid of black people, buddy. <laughs> um, excuse me. Excuse me. I beg to differ. He's running away. Come on, crack it. Me. I beg to differ. What? Excuse me, sir. You are mistaken. <laughs> Uh, okay, what is this one? Channels like this is why the dislike button should exist. Well, it does. So there you go. You did it. It's just so funny. Uh, have you... Listen. Listen. Any viewership is better than no viewership. Let it, you, you can let it be negative. It's funny. But let me just ask you something. Never mind. You know what? I don't know. It's the internet. You know, people just say stuff. People say stuff. But, like, I just don't, for me personally, and if, if you do this, that's okay. Me personally, I don't think I've ever once commented, like, anything negative ever. Like, in any shape or form. Like, in a video game, yes. I've called someone, you know, gamer words. Okay, I'll say, I'll tell you right now. I've stood up and sniffed my seat before, okay? I've, you know, I've, in video games is one thing. Trash talking is a part of it. Call of Duty lobbies, Halo lobbies, okay? Things like that, all right? 
gamer words. Uh, not not bad gamer words. Just like you know, you know. I, listen, I grew up on the internet, so time was different then. Do I go on the internet and call people things now? No, I don't. But listen, have you ever been compelled to go and comment on someone's YouTube page about like some st like that? Like I just. It's crazy to me how, like, first of all, none of these guys, none of the, none, Ben Shapiro, this is, these guys are not running for, like, political office. They don't hold any power, at least I don't think, besides, like, influence. And imagine being so passionate about fucking seeing this debate that like, oh no, you got clickbaited for something else and it's like not what you wanted. Oh, I didn't get to see Ben Shapiro. I didn't get to see Destiny own Ben Shapiro. Like what a little bitch. Anyways, I'm not actually offended, but, uh, or am I mad? I think it's, act I, uh, legitimately, I think this is hilarious. Like this has been very entertaining and I honestly wish that there was more comments of people just getting mad because it's fun to look at but i just can't imagine being that guy that go that comments on <laughs> comments on a on a 10 you first of all you spent the time to comment on a 10 viewer andy fuck you you know what i'm saying what is the debate scheduled for i don't actually know i don't even know yeah, well, uh, you should look at the dislike ratio. It's pretty bad, actually. Let me see if I can find the dislike ratio here. Let's see here. Where is that? Where can I find that? Um... For, also, what I want to say is this is all from Google. You know what's funny is if you actually type in... If you type in Ben Shapiro Destiny debate, actually, let's just see what happens if I. Yeah, that my mine is the, mine is the first thing you see. <laughs> I don't know if that's the same. Let's go to incognito. Uh, yeah, I mean, mine is the first thing you see. So. <laughs> uh, okay. Anyways, um. All right, let me see here. Let me look. Uh, I don't know how you've looked this up, though. Engagement. Okay, likes versus dislikes. Um, okay, we have two likes. Two likes on the video. Dislikes, 353. <laughs> um... If Ben Shapiro played Warframe, which frame would he main? Uh, in Eros. Little bitch. Or Yareli. I don't know. I'm just naming off the worst community voted frames. The drinking out of cups incident. Exactly. I talk shit on Facebook all the time when I'm taking a giant poopy. No, I know that's a pastime for a lot of people. Is, um, to talk shit on the internet. Um, I don't even know. Wait, what? What does Ben fucking even talk about? Um, I don't know. Just like, he probably, he like, Ben Shapiro does this thing where like he makes you, he makes like viewers suck his cock and then he like convinces them that they're gay and then gets mad at them for being gay. It's real. It's Look it up. It's true. He made me made me gargle his cum. Ben Shapiro made me gargle his cum, and then he got mad at me for being homosexual. And I was like, "Dude, I you convinced me. Like, I was looking at your beautiful, fucking weird ass face, and the way you fucking you talk like this, and I was getting horny, and then then he hated me." He made me gay, and then he, then he, I, it's got like three likes now. I got, 
<laughs> no, that's awesome. Rain, uh, you know, hey, you know, you don't have to, you totally don't have to do that, but it's funny. It's very funny. It's hilarious. It's hilarious. Anyways, okay, I should probably play the game. I'm sitting here jerking off. Um, uh, I don't know. That shit's funny, though. I, You know, I'm trying to think of more Jerry. clickbait type. Oh, shit. Jerry. Yeah. I just gotta say. Yeah. This is just just been a joy to see what the ben shapiro really... oh yeah yeah dude this has just been a joy yeah. you know what i mean you've been keeping up to date and on you know that? what you know what i've been meaning to do? i've been meaning to just like to, to copy and paste the usernames <laughs> and to see like where they pop up you know like which which community gets like the most pissed off right he's saying it's destiny right what? It's, oh, did, they, okay. did they even get to the ben shapiro part because like i feel like we were trashing benny more than we were Denny. You know what I'm saying? No, I think they're just... Okay, no, I think they're mad because they thought it was the debate, but instead it's me talking about drinking his cum. Right. Yeah. And if they were... Listen, if they were in the know, they'd know that that debate hasn't happened yet. Yes. So what are they thinking, huh? Well, they're just mad at me, mad at me for putting the title like, oh, this is the debate. But, but I didn't. I mean, I, mean, I, I suppose kind you could have said disgusting. Should I change the upcoming... it? Upcoming. I don't know. Chat, what do you think? Yeah, I don't think they're gonna. They can't report shit. What are they gonna report? I don't, well, I don't know. What do you? <laughs> I think the damage has been done. I think it's but awesome. The, but you know, I think it's. I think it's super awesome. But I was gonna say, dude. Um. If it's if it's uh if it's if it's Destiny viewers, wow, that is do you, that. Do you know how much power that is, Jer? If do you know what? how much power that is to piss them if off. Those are Destiny viewers that are pissed off. <clears throat> Change channel to Siphon. Well, oh yeah, that, Sip and Benny's that's, that's, come. His, that's, that's his sister, by the way. Oh uh, yeah, I've seen that's that picture before. Have you, you've seen you've seen her before? Yeah. Okay, don't look too deep into that. All right. No, I I I've. I don't, I don't, I don't, I'm just saying, I, I know I'm she's just got saying, big tits, I don't care, I don't, I don't, it doesn't yeah. do it, right. yeah, yeah, there's no, I, mean, I was just putting that up for, uh, Kiss, Kiss needed to look okay. at some tits, okay, but, but what am I saying, dude, yes, um, those Destiny guys, if, if, if that's them, that's, dude, they are, uh, they're susceptible, you know what I'm saying, so they're gonna, they they're could fuck me up, to, to uh to leaving comments oh, and engagement. Show it again. No, kiss, I'm not gonna show it again. You're gonna get me in trouble. You're gonna get me <laughs> in trouble up, with the misses. Just look up Ben Shapiro Milkies, dude. Uh yeah, kiss, you uh -huh. type into Google. I know you got like fucking five different monitors over there, cutie. Go put up Ben Shapiro's Milkies uh, or not Ben Shapiro or whatever sister. She looks like Ben if she if she if he put balloons in his shirt. <laughs> it's like that is so true. Yeah, actually, it kind of is. it's like it's uncanny how similar it they look, is. which is really weird. It's funny. It's, I went to kind of school with a kid. He didn't look like Ben Shapiro, but kind of this similar vibe. And it's funny because he also had a sister who was like a year younger, and she looked like him. And it was unfortunate looking, you know. Oh boy, you know, oh, yeah. kind of sad when that happens. That's, yeah, that's, that's hard. I I knew I knew uh, a few Iranian kids. Yeah. And uh, uh, one, you know, um, they were like, I think they were twins. Uh, it's like a brother and a sister, and and the, let, let me tell you, this sister, oh boy. Is it oh, boy. attractive? No. Oh. She uh She had a little bit of a stash. Oh. A little pistachio. Oh, pistachio. Yeah, it was unforged. It was unforged. Unfortunate. But uh anyway. Um So that's dude. Good job. I'm just I'm just saying congratulations. Uh, well, you're the one who made the title. On your <laughs> <laughs> I just, I would say that out of like out of like out of like the skits we've done on this on this you know that one's cast killing you the most that, was a, that what that one was a good one <laughs> <laughs> was that one was wild I don't know the Catholic stuff in the in Disneyland 
this is uh i mean i you, you think know. that was your favorite i think that's always gonna be a home run in my book somewhere oh man yeah we got some hallmarks huh that was that's pretty good yeah also the story of me talking about jerking off really young. wait which one uh oh when, when i was like it was fantastic because when i nutted <laughs> and then i just start laughing oh yeah that was a that was a yeah I, I i think about that often so uh, also, you know what? Well, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta put together like a mega comedy compilation. Well, yeah. The, also, the one was Singer good. talking about how he comes all over his belly, and I'm just like, I'm just like, fucking attacking him on how he jerks off, and like he's telling the whole stream. <laughs> I, that, that's pretty good too. That's a hard. That's hard. Yeah, that was that was that was pretty S tier content. And that's like, <laughs> man. Also, I wanted to make a whole video out of that thing. I have like a whole. I want to do like a whole animated thing with pictures and <laughs> yes. show Singer jerking off all over his belly button. So, um, excellent. And him trying to stuff paper towels down a, a faulty toilet that, where the where this flusher don't work too good. Yes, yes. But um, in terms of awesome. other people, Ben Shapiro sucking dick. Uh yeah, I just That's man, good. that was that was really good. And you know, just I'm still thinking about it. You know, I'm like, gosh, that's really what he would do. He would tell you to, you know, he'd he's tell like, you to hey, you're gonna suck, suck my gems, and, and he'd get mad at you for being gay. <laughs> and, listen, and I was like, uh, the way you the way you impersonated his voice too <sighs> was uh, just there's just something about it. I just like, really he, hope you know, that like someone who did view that video, um. <laughs> I just hope someone who did view that actually went to the timestamp of when we started talking about him sucking dick <laughs> or him getting his dick sucked. Uh, well, dude, I saw you got like a so few good. subscribers from I don't know. That up. Well, the Kuvalich video has been blown up again, so it could be that. But oh, okay. yeah, I don't know. I'm just I'm just gonna like I'm just like gaslighting myself into thinking that like man like they really like the Ben Shapiro skit. <laughs> I feel like it would probably have more likes if 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 they did, but yeah, that's unfortunate. Yeah, Go now ahead. you have to name all the future uploads about Destiny something about Ben Shapiro. Shapiro. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> I was thinking, I I don't know any other clickbait things. I mean, I'm sure I could sit there and come up with one, but I don't know if I want to do that though. I feel like I will get in trouble if I do enough clickbait things, but maybe not. Yeah, you're. I mean, you're also poking a beehive. We don't know. Yeah, don't know what that's, I don't know if I want the about. Ben Shapiro Destiny haters on my case, but yeah, it could be funny. I don't want to be an LOL funny. cow, you know. No, wait, a lol cow. Huh? A lol cow. I don't think I uh, possess that ability, that... but you know, maybe. Isn't that reserved for people who like have like uh, like basically like emotional breakdowns like on the internet? I think it's, sometimes it's kind of autism too. Yeah, it's like it's like autism and like emotional. Breakdown. Yeah, I guess. And, yeah. But uh, I don't know. Well, like Ice Poseidon kind of was like a little cow for a second there. Should let me think about that. I. Yeah. Yeah, but I guess yeah, I guess so. Oh, I don't. He t he just strikes me as too much of like a. Which one is it? A psychopath or a sociopath? How do you define that? Does anyone know? Sociopath is like a regular person, but they are well. Okay, and a psychopath is like they they're gonna like physically harm people. I, you know, I don't. Let's look it up. I don't know. Sociopath versus psychopath. Sociopaths tend to act more impulsively and erratically compared to psychopaths. Sociopaths generally struggle to maintain a job or family life, whereas psychopaths may be able to do so. While psychopaths generally struggle to form attachments, sociopaths may be able to do so with a like-minded individual. Listen, I never claim to be smart with like words and shit, so but you know, I don't somehow I feel like Ice Poseidon avoided becoming like a a lol cow against his volition. Like, I feel like he still kind of maintained a little bit of control over okay. what he was trying to do. Whereas, like, someone like Chris Chan, like, they just can't help it. You know what I mean? Yeah, uh, okay. 
Louis Bluey. Uh, hello. Woo, 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 woo. Hello. How are you? How's Puerto Rico? Yeah. <clears throat> I was saying, uh, does yeah, give a fuck, just, you know. yeah, he doesn't give a fuck at all. Yeah. But, uh, so, but anyway, I don't. Yeah, I don't think you could. I don't think you could become a lo lol cow unless like you uh, you start like having like mental breakdowns, right? I feel like that's sort of the vibe of that. I guess. What, what is there like a term for someone who like it's like cool? Like, okay, have you ever looked at Joey? You know Joey. You know Joey's super cool food reviews. Have you ever looked like at the comments on one of his videos? Like recently? Well, uh, here, let me let me just pull up an example. I have to. Okay. Joey's world tour. We're just gonna go to like just the first video we see here. Okay. All right. Let's see here. Um. Hold on, this is not. We need like a full length video. Let me. Let's go to the Jack in the Box new was... Smash Burger review. Yes, I did watch part of this video. Um, Joey smashed my box hole in on New Year's Eve, and it was the best we had in many years. Joey said, "I am a good muchacho. He will release me from the dungeon this year." Um, official seat <laughs> sniffing crew checking in. Joey, twenty twenty four. Jerry, oh I wish I rang in the New Year with you. Heart emoji. Joey smashes wow. the muchachos in his dungeon. Anyone who thinks the dungeon was dank and dirty before should see it now. That New Year's party was wild. Master Joey, I'm still feeling those after effects. Woo 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 woo. Um, so yeah, there's a lot of things that like, um, like man, I really want to sniff his seat. Damn, this dude is still alive. Um, you know, just shit like that. So yeah, that's it's like that's that is kind of lol cowy, huh? Yeah, I think a little bit, right? Yeah. And like, I don't—he doesn't have control over that. I remember one I time he made a video. Gravity and mean spiritedness required for someone to be a lol cow. I guess I don't. What were you gonna <laughs> that's say? That's true. Um. I remember Joey making a video like, hey, can everyone just be kind in the comments and like just be nice to one another? And then, uh, man, I don't I don't know what the video was, but the comments on that one were fucking insane. <laughs> it's like oh, no. people were just going off, just like being even worse than. Yeah, there was a while there. He was disabling comments, too. I don't know. Um, There was um, there was a, someone I was really interested in watching for a while. His name was Rage do uh i don't know if he still does anything on the internet but he i thought he was i thought what he was doing was really funny he was doing like this typical like college campus like prank sort, sort of stuff but he was like a he was a little more like uh who, who's that who's that weird uh comedian that jim carrey played um oh uh, uh yeah andy kaufman yeah, he had a little bit more of like an Andy Kaufman vibe, so you didn't know if he was being serious or any or not. His name was Rage Stew, and then uh, one day he went, he like he he did he did something bad. He went to a uh, he went to Ricegum's house without being invited, and he snuck into his like his oh. backyard. Remember that I heard guy? About this. Uh, I feel like that that's like a step too far when it comes to like pushing the public's buttons, you know? Hmm. But, uh, you know, if, I don't know if you're just fucking around. I think it's fine. I don't fucking know. I don't know anyway. But, well, for example, Wings of Redemption had people make fake allegations that he was a child. Really? Whoa. Oh, my God. Hey, Jerry, are you, uh, are you, do you have a break in between, in between the game? Uh, yeah, I get, what's up? Okay, we're gonna do, I want, I just have something I need to share with you, dude. Okay. All right. Wait, can so I keep playing? I do... Yeah, but I just, I just, I need your right arm for just like a second. Okay. <laughs> okay. So stick, stick your, stick your right arm out to the side. It just needs to be, it just needs to be in camera view, okay? Oh. Okay. Just, 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 just for, just a little bit. Just needs to be in camera view. Just stick your right arm out to the side. Okay. No, no, no. All the way, all the way out. Oh, it's straight. Okay. And get the fist in view. Get the fist in view. Okay, now flip your fist upside down to do a fuck you. Be away. Come on, 
Okay, are you doing a fuck you? Drop it! It's delayed. What? Okay, it's delayed. Okay, now think about this fuck you you're doing, okay? Uh, there's a crackhead on screen. So, th I, I'm doing it with you, right? You can't see me. I'm doing it right now. But I just, I want to, I want to, I want you to just think about the fuck you. And, ha like, if this fuck you could just keep traveling, how many, th how many people do you think it could, it would hit before it came right back around to your, your hand again? How many people do you think that fuck you would pass through? Like, in the planet? Yeah, on the planet. Or I will, I don't know. Well, actually, let's hold on a second. We can back up even further. Would the fuck you, okay, you can put your hand down now. Oh. But do you think the fuck you would would go around the Earth or would it got into space and you'd be like saying fuck you to aliens and shit? Well, this is the flat is Earth theory. You... Oh, shit. I'm just. <laughs> actually, how would does that work? Yeah, actually, well, you know, I mean, this is a really big conversation, right? If you're holding your, just, if you're doing, like, a fuck you, like, how far does, it, like, is your fuck you range? Is it, like, ten feet? Is it, like, a mile? I mean, I think my fuck you would fizzle out. Uh, there's not a lot of, like, care in that fuck you that I, who am I saying fuck you to, you know what no, I'm no, saying? No, 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 you're just, you, no, 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 you're not, you're not saying it to anyone. You're just, like, I, we're just, just doing, we're just, you. it's an experiment. Well, I'm, yeah. well, my point like, is, oh, is that if I, if I felt strongly about the fuck you, it would go farther. If you said a fuck you? If I meant the fuck you to someone, it would go farther. Oh, it would go farther. Yeah. Okay, so it sort of like has like a, it has like a, a like a hate energy attached. Yeah, there's to like it. a hateful energy to it that I, <laughs> okay. that I feel. <laughs> if around the earth, I'm gonna say two hundred forty thousand. Two hundred forty thousand. Oh, well, <laughs> and 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 ten people at the end there. Is it affected by gravity? I don't. That's what I want to know. You know. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if we're just making up new rules here, you just make up anything you want, you know. At this, so at this point, yeah, it would go around. It would circle around the whole Earth like Superman and like fuck everyone up, probably. Yeah, you think yeah. so? Kiss says four hundred twenty-eight thousand six hundred twelve. Okay, wow. See, I've said like I, my estimate was like at least like ten thousand, right? And but yeah, it going through India is prob probably a very good point because oh, like there's a lot of people. Dude, in India. if you started the fuck you in India, that's it's over. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I think yeah, you they're, just might. They're might. done over there. <laughs> yeah, I think they're gonna be done. They're gonna be done. You know? Oh wow, <laughs> five thousand yeah. two hundred, five hundred twenty-five thousand six hundred minutes. Does it then become a fuck they them? Well, I mean, I don't know how where oh, you're going. Oh yeah, I don't know dude. where you're going with that one, but it's a non-discriminatory fuck you. I'll <laughs> tell you that one. It's a fuck you all over the planet. I don't care Actually, what you got in between your fucking pants or <laughs> how you identify. You're getting fucked. You know what I'm saying? That's you're gonna get great point. You're gonna get <laughs> fucked up. Okay. Oh fuck. Oh, that's good. You can be whatever you yeah. want. You're getting fucked in the yeah, ass. Well, it's weird because I, I, I poison it as like a fuck you as in like, you know, but if it's passing through multiple people, then it's going to be like a fuck plural. You fuck them. Fuck they. Fuck them. Fuck they. Wow. Yeah. Anyway. Well, I'm glad we cleared that up. Thanks. Whoa, wait. Did you know that about corrupted hollow keys? You get them from Vale Proxima and can use the keys at Arbiters to buy the tenant weapons without doing the liches. Yes. Yeah, I think it's for right now though, I think the only thing you can buy with them is the melee tenant weapons. Um yeah, you can't get the melee tenant weapons from the from doing the sister farms. Um Harmon, that's a horrible grind though. You need like what? It's like twenty corrupted hollow keys to do shit? It's a long, it's a long grind. It took me a very long time to finish that one. Because railjack stuff is annoying. So, how much standing do you have with your syndicates? I literally just spent all my shit because of the relic packs. So I have no standing right now. I have, like pretty much with any of my stuff besides like, the, you know, I mean some other shit, you know, but. 40 keys for one? Holy shit. Oh my god. That's a lot. Oh fuck, I can buy these relic packs. I kind of forgot I had this. I got a Neo A11. No. 
Okay. Uh, if anyone has a Neo A11, I have another one. I just got one. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Those are all new relics. Yeah. Wait, what? They were? Oh, they were? I didn't even look. All I care about right now is Neo A11. And I, man, I, this is going to be my last one that I can rad, so... Fuck me. I have a tenant, a, a dachi. I have a fucking yeast infection. You know what I'm saying? Ginger gauge. Uh, what's the progress on Gauss farm so far? I mean, I'm done with Gauss. I just need fucking, I need the last thing I need. I can show you. If you're asking about my progress, this is the last thing I need is right here. This bad boy right here. It's for Acarius Prime. The blueprint. Why oh why? Oh, oh, I'm trying oh, to help you, Why oh why didn't I take the blue pill? There we go. Um, this is the last thing I need, but everything else is done. This is building, this is building. Just this. Just this. Well, anyways. So fuck you, you know? Not you. Not I'm talking about fuck the fuck. See the snap finish? Yeah, it's crazy. The Curious takes six parts and three of them are rare. It's fucking bullshit, Kiss. It's been horrible. I can rad one relic? Okay. Odachi oh, is big katana. Ooh, Adachi. That sounds so sexual. You know that, Louie? Lu Louie Blue... Louie Bluey? I'm gonna call you Louie, okay? I know we've already... I've already fucked around with your name a million times in the past, but I'm fucking with it again. I'm calling you Louie, because I like it. When I see your name, I think your name is Louie, and I like it. Louie, 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 Louie. That sucks. He can't. Fuck. CK. What was his name? What was his name? Louis CK? CK Lewis? What's his name? Check. It's Louis CK. Hey, Lu Jerry, can, yeah. you do, can you do a Giga Chad face? Oh, I have to look at it. Man, I've, I haven't... I've been trying. It's uh, it's not easy. Yeah, that's yeah. Well, it kind of looks like Max Payne a little bit. Shit, my chin ain't long enough. Is this guy real, by the way? Yeah, he's a real guy. I I, I can it's only frown. Stuff. <laughs> Fuck, I can't do that. All right, hold on. I got to start this mission. Um, Lewis Cock. He's not real. Okay. Um, what am I doing? Uh, check out this. Check out this twenty-six minute, twenty-six uh, second video, and see if you can do this guy's face. Why did I just get invited to Conclave? Okay, wait. Hold on. I gotta get this group going, but I will. Why did someone just invite me to Conclave? Fuck this. God, I hate doing this shit. Um. Oh man, and we do not have a single good mission. Kiss, we don't have a single... They want to... <laughs> They're mad about the Destiny video. They want to 1v1 me. Um, oh, wait. There's an exterminate one. That must have just popped up. Okay. Please, for the love of God. RNG Jesus. RNG Jesus. Sucking in your cheeks helps with a bad face. But then I can't smile. Is he, is he really smiling, though? Or is he just a Chad? He's just Chad. Okay, let's see this video. Jack in the Box, new Smash... Oh, wait, that's a different... Oh, I've seen this video. Your I like this guy. Yeah, dude, that's a... It's him. That's the guy. Yeah, it's it is. The guy. You can do your version of my Max Payne Krimis. I will now show you how. First, push your chin forward. Now straighten your nose. 
narrow your mouth, lift your cheeks up, squint your eyes, arch your eyebrows. And there he is, <laughs> painted the max. <laughs> I can't do it. <laughs> Fuck, that's hard. All right, anyways. Okay. Is that Doctor Who? There are your mouth around these nuts. No, dude, that's Max Payne, dude. That's the guy. That's the guy. Pain. Did you Always see uh did pain. you see his uh, cameo appearance in Alan Wake? Yeah, well he made the game. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. So uh, cool. I uh I really want to play through those games actually. Oh, you want actually want to hear some sad news? Yeah, I know the guy died. Yeah, Is the that guy does the voice of Max Payne died. Yeah. yeah. Jerry, I'm sad now. I thought I told you that. Did you tell me that? I thought so. Maybe. I can't remember. How the fuck did he narrow his news? How, how, how did the fuck did he narrow his news? How did he narrow his <laughs> nose? New skill unlock? That was. It was a skill unlock. Yeah, I don't know how he did that either. I, I can only widen my he, nose. He has like a kind of a long face though, you know. I think he that, does. that kind of helps him out through that. Yeah. I, you know what was so weird when I when I fought, first saw that video? I was like, oh shit, he's like a European guy. Yeah. And I didn't realize from? that. Uh, I think he's like a Northern European guy, right? He's like Swedish. Or is he Swedish? Or he's Norwegian Swedish? Or from Denmark. Ah, the French champagne. Not French, though. No, I don't... Th well, uh, maybe. Dude, I don't know. You... I know you not. I know you don't play a lot of like games and shit, but man, their game I'm control. A what? What? You're I'm a what? A You're a normie. Jay, I'm a normie. I'm I know, a but their game control that they made was like really fucking cool. Wait, which? Sorry, which one? <gasps> we got it. Poggers. Poggers. You guys got double. Poggers. I finished. Oh my god, your pussy is pogger. Oh shit, wait, I can't say that. Huh? Wait, why? Can I not say that? Oh my god, your pussy is poggers? You oh can't say god, that? Oh my god, your pussy is poggers? Why can't you say that? You can't? I don't know, is that too, is that sexual endo endo? Oh my god, your pussy's poggers. Oh, oh my god. God, I mean, I don't know. Poggers. What the fuck can you do? If someone can, like, fucking imply nudity in a fucking stream, I can't say your pussy's poggers. That's bullshit. Yeah, I get it. <gasps> and I got a fucking fart sensual in here. Okay. Um. Oh, wait, did I just leave? I don't know what I just did. You can't do that anymore. I can't. Well, I know you can't do it anymore, but. Fuck them. I'm gonna fucking. I'm gonna play this. Holy oh, fuck. fuck. I'm coming. I'm gonna play that. What are they gonna do? Fuckers. Huh? Fuckers? I'm about to fucking nut. Um, hey, fuckers. Wait, hold on. Can I do see something? Does this work if I do this? Causing a ruckus, causing mud. Did you hear that? Yeah, I did. I heard it. All the live long day and night. All the live long day and night. <laughs> Oh, here. I'm over here stroking my dick. I got lotion on my dick right now. I'm just stroking my shit. <laughs> so, Bam's, uh, Bam's, um, he's sober. He's on the up and up? Bam Argera. Do you think he will last, uh, though? Man, I, you know, I hope so. I, uh, you know, I love the guy. Yeah, I care about him. How's he doing? Damn, I only know how to do Donald Duck and Mickey Mouse, like the voice. Oh, ho. Oh. Oh. How do you how the fuck do you do Donald Duck? I do not know how people they go I don't I don't my my temper. I don't I don't I don't I don't know how you fucking do Donald Duck. What about Meatwall? Yeah, what's up, Meatwall? A rise chicken. A rise chicken. I'm a call you all drippy because you're dripping all over my stuff. Do what now? I'm gonna call Do you all drippy. 
What's up, bro? I love a, a Miwat. Miwat's the best. What else? Do a Ben Shapiro. <laughs> Me? Yeah. Um. I'm so you're so gonna suck my dick, man. <laughs> now you're gay. <laughs> I can't do it. I saw so hard. Yours is really good though. <laughs> Let's listen to him. Let's look up. Let's listen to like a yeah, couple I of hear, things. Yeah, I want to hear. I want to hear him. I want to hear what he has to say. Ben Shapiro speaking. Let's look up Ben Shapiro compilation. The journey is usually the part that you remember, anyways. Oh, no, then, then I just let's just see. these values. When Where, so I don't want to see, see other people talking. I want to see him talking. To come out transgender. Oh great, we're gonna get in trouble. God. Hold on, let's actually just. When you said in that video that God Ms. Lee... They have him, like, I reacting not... to memes now? Yeah, it. I don't know. Just Shapiro talking. Here we, there we go. Dude. 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 Like, it's just, it's just Dude. like, tons of clips. Without just, further ado. Like, looking at videos. That's funny. I mean, he, his, his entire... Okay, here we go. He's done. He's done doing commentary. Yeah. Here we go. Yeah, do this one, right? There he is. To get on TV, to have a podcast. To, they they want to do what I do for a living. Right, and and so what they've decided to do is use electoral office as a platform to do what I do for a living, and what that ends up with very often is complete practical political inability and a lot of grandstanding. See, that's so okay. I don't know if you heard it or not, but so like and and it, it's not even. <laughs> Yeah, it's like he's like it's like he like swallowed a lemon and it, became one. You know, I, it, they want to do what I want to do. They're doing what I'm doing, and I, I and, and I'm too busy uh, hating gay people that and making them suck my dick, and, and then getting mad at them for sucking my dick. So uh, basically, you're already jerking me off right now. Okay. And basically, I, I tried to do gay porn, and it was more profitable for me to just have people suck me off and call them gay, and Here's then the you thing. know, I basically I made more money off that. Here's the thing: is I got rejected from doing gay pornography films, right? In 1999. So, because they rejected me, I decided to go the other route, political, and start hating gay people because they didn't want me in gay porn. So, I said, fuck them. I'm going to get mad at them. Okay. And I just start. Uh, I, I, I just. There were just there were just all these like sloppy boners back in the 90s when I was yeah. trying to do gay porn and yeah. I just couldn't I just, there just wasn't enough lube there wasn't a lube shortage back yeah. then so I just I couldn't suck them off and I couldn't <laughs> I couldn't rub them off so now. Yeah, listen we had a guy named, named Jim he he was going there going <laughs> he had to spit on every single one of the cocks and, but for some reason I'm the one who got rejected I always had the had the my tip was always creamy okay yeah see the guy who who kept spitting on all the cocks people kept mistaking me for him and so we got kind of got you know i just got tired of being confused with the guy who spits on the cocks instead of being the guy who gets yeah. in gay porn yeah that thing okay i'm gonna watch this video i don't know so, if this yeah, is gonna that... be a bad video though okay what about destiny can you do a destiny well hold on but Ray rayon wants us to watch my tip creamy okay okay, okay so what's that? we're gonna take a chance on this one all right if not you're gonna get in trouble okay all right, let's check it out. Hold on, let me turn the music off here. I'm fat, man. She got me my tip creaming right now. My tip, my tip sticky. Tip real sticky and moist. I'm playing, I'm playing with it a little bit. Flicking it, flick my, flick my tip a little bit. Got, 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 got semen on my fingers and shit. That's, okay, maybe this is the guy who was doing this. I'm pretty sure this guy was... Sending this shit to... I don't even know. What am I looking up? What does he want me to look up? Sticky the Call of Duty clip. Sticky the Call of Duty clip. You see the pastor who thinks Starbucks is putting cum in their coffee to turn people gay? <laughs> no. Here, let's see this video. Oh wait, this is not the video. You know, Rayon, you can um post you can post links if you'd like, so Did you see the pastor is okay, what is this? Is a news thing here? The Manning Report. But the deal is this is that the woman didn't realize who's who's uh, an associate, her name was Jess. Wait, or drinking cum makes you gay? Um never. 
that when questioned me about Starbucks and its lattes, that it's a really it's a concoction of milk. Uh, the John Stewart woman uh, associate. I said, yes, it is a concoction of milk with some flavoring in it. Yes. Um, and I said to her that milk is something that's produced by the mammary glands, and it is a body fluid, however, albeit produced by the mammary glands, and people tend to like its taste. It tends to nourish people. It tends to give life is probably... You know, it's, it's a strange thing that milk comes from the mammary glands and, and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And I said that semen, because you know what? I had this thing going back a year ago with me talking about semen and, 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 and Starbucks lattes. And they do put it in there. And many people slammed me and said I should get off of it. And one guy wrote me and told me he wasn't going to send me any more offerings until I stopped talking about semen, uh, semen uh, in Starbucks coffee. I told him to keep his offerings. Uh, but at any rate, the uh, semen is, is another kind of milk. Is something that's produced <laughs> by the testicle glands of a man. People tend to like milk that's produced by the mammary glands of a woman. <laughs> Starbucks has figured out that people tend to like semen that's produced by the testicle glands of a man. So what's the big deal? If they mix milk and semen together, <laughs> makes for some people, a nice taste. Now, I don't go to Starbucks. I don't drink coffee, first of all. But when I said that, I know they're not going to add that. I know they're not going to edit that. I know they're not going to put that on the air. They're not going to do that. But don't argue with me. Don't, don't, don't you argue with me. <laughs> Milk, mammary glands, semen, testicle glands, both are naturally produced by the body, and a lot of people tend to like them. So Starbucks has figured it out. So they blend a little semen synthetic with their synthetic blends of milk. And people drink Starbucks coffee. I don't. And I will not. And I advise you, don't drink it either. Unless you will drink some synthetic semen. Now. Wow. Makes, I know Real that quick. I, yeah. Imagine him jerking off. Yeah, yeah, I could, I could see it. Yeah, you could see him like just kind of hate jerking off a little bit. You know, I, I could see I, someone like this guy. He's probably he has he has like some weird stuff he's watching when he's jerking off. Now, what do you think saying? he jerks off to? Oh, it's gotta be it's gotta be some BDSM stuff. Yeah, like he's into like getting you know, stepped it's on. Be, it's stuff. gotta be like it's gotta be like women like yelling at you know him or something. Yeah, it's got it just has to be. You know, there's a lot of really good quotable stuff here. He says semen, really good one here. And People tend to like milk that's produced by the just mammary glands happens. of a woman. On here. Starbucks has figured out that people tend to like semen that's produced by the yeah. testicle glands of a man. So what's uh, the I think I'm going to get some sound bites from this guy. Is him saying semen? He says semen very well. So uh, that is favorited. That is favorited. I'm going to write notes here too. Um, add semen. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna write add semen, and I, hopefully I know what that is. So, yeah, that's good. Well, that made me laugh, and I have to pee. So, um, yeah, I gotta pee too. Okay, I'll be back. <laughs> no, no, okay, okay, here for me. Okay, here. Now, watch it. Now, throw him this way. This way. This way. This way. Here. This way. This way. Come here.
kitties? Stinky? Je this this is Jane. Mm, this is John. You ordered a package at your household. It was a jet black dildo at least 18 inches long, and you know we lied to you. It's only 16 inches. I hope this isn't going to be a problem. Please get back to me as fast as possible. You know my number is always available. Yeah, there's three cats here. This is Jim James Jefferson uh, returning your call. Uh, I, uh, you were so you were inquiring about having sex with me. Uh, well, I can make that happen. Just uh, give me a call back at this number, and I should be able to plow you good right in the asshole, fucking bitch, stupid ass. Fuck. Um, okay, we're back. Hey, the stream fucked up a little bit. Um, I don't know why. It's just like, I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm nervous that if I move over to Streamlabs that I'm just going to have a whole nother host of fucking problems and issues. And I just, I don't even know. Sometimes I just think OBS just sucks, though. <laughs> I've looked at Streamlabs too, and that kind of sucks too. I gotta be honest with you. <laughs> what happened? Whatever happened to X Split? Remember that one? I think that is gone. Let me see. Oh no, it's still there. Huh? I don't know. Just having to learn a whole nother pro program. It's just like I'm already comfortable with this one, but obviously not comfortable enough because I fucking shit goes wrong. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. It's like I, got, I upgraded the internet thinking that that would, you know, whatever. Uh, whatever. I don't know. Fucking bullshit. Okay, well, anyways, I don't know. I'm, like, on top of the world now. I finished my grind. Um, I'm, like, I'm done. I never claimed this. I could claim this and fuck around with this. Can I join on Relic Hunt? Uh, I do Louis, I did just finish, but if you want to just open up like random relics, we can. But if you want specific relics, I don't, I don't have any void traces to do so. Honestly, I like I use the last of it just right now. So, um, if you just want to open random relics, I can do that though. So wait, how does this work? Archon shards. Oh, whoa. I don't know if I want to do this though right now. How many shards do I have? Open relics. Okay. I, we could do that. Um, I'll fuck with this another time. 
Let's do it. Louie, do I have you in my things? I don't. Wait, let me see. Do I have you written down here? Louie, what's your name again in the game? Let me write you down or add you. Is it the same as your thing? Let me try. No. Um. Well, check do you any desire to check out that Project Ascension? <laughs> yeah, you trying to trying to trying to get me on uh, on the old Wow train? It's free. <laughs> it's not free. You don't have to, but. I mean, you know, I might check it out. Uh, I might take a little peeper. Peeper. Uh, I got I got I got I, I got something else. We could, yeah. we could chat a little bit about. Yeah, 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 yeah. I also I have some stream topics that I just have not fucking looked at for a long time too. So when hey, you let me know. All right, you want to you want to no you, you, one or you want no you go. It's probably okay. Better you go. Gonna, oh you wait, go. I go. You go. I go. You go. That's like that's like a Russian guy's name. You go. You go. You go. Right. Da, da, da. So, speaking of Russians, uh, Russia's kind of cold, isn't it? It is. It's and cold here. And I feel like, uh, I feel like uh, just recently, I don't know about the rest of the, the chat, but uh, has the cold kind of just fucked everything up for everyone else? Oh, yeah. Are you home? How was your experience? Yeah, I'm at home, finally. Uh, I've had, I've been, yeah, about five days without power. Wow. And, uh, I came home. Nutted. And I have furiously beat off. And then <laughs> I noticed there was water leaking in my, through my walls. Yeah, I had some fucking pipes bust. <laughs> so I spent... Spent the day <laughs> fixing pipes in my walls. Today? Yeah, today. It was Holy so fucking freezing. It was fucking freezing. Did you fix it? Uh, yeah, I fixed it. So it's you had to like was... solder and like and and cut away and then like re glue the shit, right? Wait, you're doing relics, right? Yeah. Oh shit. Okay. Kiss, kiss looks I like kiss in on some action. Fuck, kiss. I, I'll, it, yeah, I don't know if I can invite you still. I'll invite you. Okay, I can't. I'll invite you to the next one. You could, like you had to use like that special like goo right to like re fix the things. Uh, well, yeah, basically, I for a pipe repair like that, you have to. I'm I'm using there like if it's an old building, you're gonna have galvanized pipe, and so it, you know. If it, water gets in there and freezes it's gonna shatter especially if it's really old so i just chopped it out the bad sections and then if there was threads on the old pipe i would i just converted it to pex which is like a plastic uh, pipe and it's yeah last like it's probably gonna outlast my lifetime so Dude, that's, that's fucked good. up yeah and it's it was like i don't know you start you know you start kind of and it was all in my attic so i'm like fucking hunched over it sucked so, so, does it burst immediately, or does it happen when you turn water on? I really don't. I have, like, I have no idea how it works, but um, it was crazy. So, the pipe, uh, it was joined with like an elbow, right? You know, it has yeah. like a little elbow. And the elbow was cracked literally in half. So, oh, wow. um, I had to lay new pipe, baby. <laughs> wow. Well, I mean, was that your first time doing that? I was pipe! What? No, I've done, oh, okay. I've done that. I've done that job a lot. Was there water damage in your wall though? Now? Uh, no. I think I caught it early enough. So I'm hoping. Um, once, like it's it's actually currently 53 degrees in here right now. It's gonna <gasps> take a while for it all to heat up. So. When did you get uh, home? I actually oh. had my had my fucking oven <laughs> going at oh 500 my. degrees. Oh my <laughs> for god. Like, for like three hours. Yeah, you're fucking so, cause a fire. I probably could, but dude, I got a I got a spray bottle ready for any fires. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh my god! Spray, but, yeah. Anyway. 
Damn. Uh, but yeah, so it's, I don't know about you guys, but this has been really, really brutal. I, I don't think I've had to deal with such Does terrible. Does your water, is it just on your built, like you didn't share, you don't share water with anyone else, do you? Yeah, actually I do share a water line that runs throughout like a, my building. So. so you had to like tell them like, hey. Uh, no, I, I put a shut off just for my, um unit so i could shut the water off to just me but Fuck i don't know what, what how extensive the damage is for the other people so we'll find out oh but God. yeah anyway i got my window open it's 59 degrees here you're so lucky it fucking florida sounds awesome yeah he is in florida um we had pretty much any pipe on an exterior wall freeze up you know no burst no nope. burst burst um i was nervous like because it can happen to even if it is really cold outside and it's warm inside your place if you like sometimes if you like run the water or something it can like burst like that too and i was nervous about that i was like running hot water and stuff and i'm like nervous that like something like that could happen you know here's, i think it's here's unlikely the, here's the but... situation uh, the only reason why this was a problem was because you know power was out for so long yeah so when you don't have power and the interior of the home starts freezing over you know all the water that is usually supposed to be you know room temperature is now or or just even above freezing is now gonna start causing damage so i mean this is like Fucking... this has been really fucked up <laughs> yeah you know what it's gonna do Causing a ruckus, causing mud. That's what it's gonna do. It is gonna cause a ruckus. So. I <laughs> guess <I> already knew. <laughs> um, Jesus, that's fucked yeah, up. Yeah, it's been it's been brutal. Uh, and then um. Stream froze. I had yeah. a I had a big wall that made out of brick that started cracking and letting water in, so I had to I had to cut all that old mortar out and repoint it and everything and it was... I fucking hate working in the cold man that it's sucks horrible. listen everyone don't do manual labor <laughs> you, know, you, know, you know my dad tried to tell me when I was a kid he was like you got use your brain not your back you know I was like yeah fuck you dad I'm gonna I'm not gonna wipe my butt <laughs> I'm never gonna wipe my butt, haha, <laughs> Dad. Never, look at me now. Never gonna wipe my butt. So if you can, if you can like become like a lawyer or something, like, you should probably do become that. doctor now. Yeah, become a doctor. Yeah, because then you can get hemorrhoids or not. If, well. Yeah. I don't know. Do Wait, like what's fucking e-commerce e or some shit. Hem Wait, what's the other one? Not Hernia. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, I did. You know if that skips a generation? Hernia. I thought a hernia could happen to anyone. Uh, I don't know. Can it? It just it looks like a ball sack emerges from your abdomen or something. Yeah, I thought that's like you can get that from like heavy lifting too much shit. Yeah. Or like pressing too hard if you like fucking take a shit. I mean, I know that's hemorrhoids, but I think you can also get a hemorrhoid from it. Or, uh, fuck. You can also get a hernia from pressing too hard to take a shit. Why was your nickname in high school hernia? <laughs> Fucking no, it wasn't. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, <laughs> actually, he did do do like a lift uh, weightlifting class. Maybe Bart Park was nickname was hernia. Dude, that's sick. Um. Uh. Yeah, but it skips a generation. You know that. Speaking of Our skipping a generation. Got a hernia. Oh, really? Yeah, so we're, we're, we're ready for one. I am kind of afraid that I'm going bald. Really? Yeah, my hair has, like, kind of thinned out a lot. Like, here's the thing. Uh, what I don't know is, first of all, I don't think wearing headphones help at all. Like this. Second of all, when COVID was happening... Uh, like the pandemic and shit. I grew everything out. I had a beard. I had Jesus hair. I had crazy shit. But the thing is, his hair was always in my face. So I would wear like uh, sweatbands to put my hair up. And 
I feel like that kind of weakened my hair a bit and like made the strands here in the front kind of loose. And I don't know if that had a cause. Also, when I, I tried to cut my own hair during the pandemic, right? And I fucked it up. So then I said, okay, fuck it. And I just buzzed it all off. And I feel like ever since then, my hair has not like grown back the same. Hmm. And I, I like here, let me see if I can, hold on. I'm going to take my headphones off so I'm not going to be able to hear you. So give me a second. Okay. If you look at my head. I'm looking. There's like, fuck, I don't know, I can't do this. Hold on. It's like, hold on. You can kind of like see into my skull. I don't know. You can like, I don't, you can. No, I don't think you look like you're balding. I don't think so. I think it's just thinned out and I'm nervous. I mean, yeah. I don't have the widow's peak. Oh. Uh... Or do I? Oh, yeah, I mean, you got you got like the Hugo weaving thing going yeah, on. Yeah, but I mean, I'm you know, nervous because Hugo you've weaving. You've always had that. Hugo weaving is going bald. Yeah, but Hugo weaving is a very handsome man. Do you see that? You see? Oh shit! Oh my God! Kiss Jesus Christ! <laughs> got that neo-Nazi swag? What the fuck? <laughs> no, I don't. Well, because I'm ba going bald. Or because no, I it's because got... Max, Max, he started talking to Max. Max, Max been shaving his head since he was 14. <laughs> it's funny because Max, <laughs> it's funny because Max is Jewish. <laughs> <laughs> How old are you? I am 28 years old. 28 years, 28 years young. <laughs> uh, I'll say this. You, you, you're gonna, you're gonna, your hair is gonna start thinning as you get older. Yes. It just will. But I, I think usually if you're, if you're balding, that that'll happen like at 25. I mean, or even before that, like you'll it'll be pretty evident. All right, well, if you're, that you're uh, if you're balding. Maybe you should start taking but boner pills. I don't think you, I don't think you got it. I don't think you. I don't think you're gonna. All right. Well. Also, um. Try and um try and uh or stop with the with the shampoo for a bit and see how your uh. Your, I kind of uh, want to. Your head feels. I just the Goofy. thing is what I hate is I have I did it in high school I actually did the no shampoo no conditioner thing and what I remember from it was that your hair does balance itself out the thing is is that process to get to that is you have like a month straight of looking like a greasy fuck and I I really hate that but yeah I do kind of want to here's the thing also when I get out of the shower I kind of fucking go crazy with the towel on my head and that's not good to do. Oh you yeah, know, you're supposed to like. You see, I gotta just pat it dry, and even and maybe not even touch it really, honestly. But you know, no, I don't know. Yeah, Goofy, how are you, Goofy? Goofy Goober, hey, I'm a Goober. fucking Goofy. That's wild. You know what's wild? Is fucking getting cigarette smoke blowing your face and a thumb up your ass. That's something fucking wild. That's how I was raised. Check Dio here as well. You know? Yeah. It's hard out in these streets. I don't know. I like. I think my my hair feels so much better without the, the fucking pro. I'll use like Have Selsun you been doing Blue that? once a month. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Or maybe, maybe like it depends. Like if I have like a really heavy, sweaty, dusty day, then I'm definitely gonna use some product some or shit. something in there. Yeah. It's disgusting. Otherwise. But most of the time, if you just like casual, you just get in the shower. You yeah. Don't if use I, anything if on not, your head? No, nothing. Just just rinse it. You're you'll be fine. Damn. All right. Yeah. It's fine. You're gonna be okay. You know what also, you know what, okay, this is probably the thing I miss the most about being a degenerate. And I still am a degenerate, but. What, how, how your dick cheese smells? No, well, there's I kind of miss. There's something kind of addicting about that, huh? There's something really addicting about smelling your the vinegar on your nutsack. You know what it's I'm talking weird, about? It's weird, isn't it? It's like a, everyone it's like enjoys a, their own smell. It's like a territorial thing. It's like primal. Yeah, I feel like man, this is like this is my domain. Like, yeah, if you fucking get close to me, you're gonna fucking smell. What like, I'm have about, you ever dude. not showered for a long time, and then like you just like fucking rub your fingers in between your sticky zone, like right where you're like your nutsack and your thigh intersects, and you rub it there, and then you just, yeah. you know, you smell I, I, that listen, shit. I, listen, I'm not, I'm not a deliberate sniffer, but oh, like yeah. if you ever just like, let's say you're like in that phase and you have like your legs crossed, you know, you're like you comfy, smell you're like wafts. Fucking, like, 
and then you uncross, dude. Yeah. Oh, and then you got and that. And you get waft. a fucking beefy ass whiff of your shit. God damn. Damn, that's crazy, dude. I want everyone get up right now and sniff your fucking seat. Let's yeah. I'm, I'm, fucking, get up, I'm getting up and I'm gonna sniff my seat. Let's find. Start out. doing the fucking crab walk see. and tell me, me what it smells like. Let me see. Let me lift this chair up here. Oh shit! This chair. Oh fuck! This chair is fucking heavy as fuck. Hold on. Let me lift this up. Yeah. 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 That smells like shit. Uh, <laughs> that smells like fucking shit. Uh, yeah. That doesn't. That does not smell good at all. Yeah. It smells like yeah. a fucking gamer. That yeah. Smells it's like just, it's fucking just not Cheetos. the same. It's just not the same, though. You know what I mean? Uh, man. Uh, well, no. Okay. What I miss most about like not being a human being is like uh, just not having a shower all the time. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yeah, doesn't that suck? I hate showering. Showering sucks dick. So, Jerry, what's the longest you've been without a shower? Um, the most recent time I can think of is during the pandemic five days. Oh, that's a ro those are rookie numbers. I know. It, can I tell a short story? I tell a okay, short story yeah, about we'll you? Okay, yeah, go ahead. Okay, I remember we went on a trip, a family trip. Hold on, I need to change my frame here real quick. We went on a family trip. Check Dio, you know, my, myself, my family, all that stuff. And, um, uh, we, um, I'm going to play Rhino. We went on a trip and where, where there was a hot tub, okay? There was a hot tub. And I remember, uh, Check Dio said, I'm just not going to shower the entire time we're here. And we were like, ew, why? Why are you going to do that? And he's like, I just want to. So... We went on this trip. We were there for like probably seven days, and he didn't shower at all. <laughs> but what he did do, I did it? yeah, what you did do is you went in the hot uh, tub. <laughs> nice. And you would not shower after you got out of the hot tub, and uh, yeah. 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 Uh, you don't remember I that? I thought you were gonna. I thought you were gonna tell a different story about. Well, it might be better um, what you're gonna tell. About the about the ramen. What? No, I what, thought you what, diarrhea the shin black. Shit. Well, what does that have to do about showering? Well, no. Here, I this is like sort of like a tradition. If I'm with my family, I'm pretty like I just I kind of just stop giving a fuck. I'm done shaving. Maybe I'll brush my teeth a little bit. Uh, the clothes. I'm like I just who cares? You know what I mean? I'm like I'm just going fucking you know Asmund Gold style. Yeah. Okay. Hell yeah. Uh, but there was yeah. There's one time we went to the coast. And I wore nothing but these, like, camel pants, like, sweatpant things and, like, a fucking wife beater. And I ate nothing but, like, spicy, like, ramen. And I just fucking ass blast the whole time. At a certain point, you were like, dude, close your legs. I did? I feel like, yeah, I feel like that's, like, that's a, that's actually been, like, a catchphrase of yours for, like, for, like, a few years. Close, like, your, close legs? your legs? Yeah, close your legs. I don't remember legs. that shit. Yeah, you thought, that's, like, you know, I something you I smelt your genitals? Yeah, you could smell. You, I'm, I mean, I waft, you know. Oh my god! That's but dude, horrible. actually, let me t let me tell you. When I so let's see, I, was, I think it was nineteen. I had moved out. Yeah. And I, you know, when you when you're at, when you're out on your own for the first time, you start getting a little bit experimental, you know. <laughs> um, and you're like, you know, and you're all alone. You start getting like a little bit weird, you yeah. know. You start oh, getting yeah. a little freaky with yourself you know so maybe you like you might scare yourself a little bit with how freaky you're getting and, yeah uh, i just decided hmm you know what would be kind of weird what if i just stopped showering for like <laughs> until whenever <laughs> and I, d I did that for like a, i must have been like a solid month oh my god yeah you had smegma I, I butter yeah I think so. And you know what's fucked up? I got a sty on my eye. <gasps> yeah. And yeah. I was like, oh shit, I'm like, I, this is what it's like to be homeless. <sighs> you got a sty in your eye. Yeah, I got a so sty on my eye. Yeah, I was like, I was just, just that gross, so. Oh, I learned wow. my lesson that. That's why, like, you know, I don't, you don't, you don't want to push it more than, like, you know, like a five day streak. Because yeah. otherwise, if you, if you, if you push it past the five day streak, then, like, you get the, you're, the, you're gonna get, like, the, the AC-130 of, like, Smegma called in on you, and Oof. then eventually the nuke's gonna hit you with the sty on your eye. It's gonna be like that, you know, in Monsters, Inc., when they, like, they, like, come in and they, like, spray the people down, you know, because yeah. they got Yeah, the, the hazmat shit happening. Yeah, that's what you got going yeah. on, Smegma. Yeah, exactly. 
So, but you know, that's it. That's you just gotta you gotta stay cleanly. You know, and you, yeah, that's cool when you're like a kid. But now, if you do that as an adult, I think you know it's kind of if that. See, that's okay. Now I do remember being a kid, and I remember I I like. You know, because we didn't really, we weren't, like, sheltered or, like, looked after a lot. So, like, I remember one time I was like, I'm just going to stop showering. I don't, like, let me just see what happens as, like, a kid. And I, I swear to God I didn't go, I didn't, I did, probably didn't shower for, like, a month. At least it felt like a month. You know how time feels different when you're younger? It probably yeah. was only, like, a, two weeks or a week and a half or something like that. So, maybe, uh, maybe that, maybe that was the longest. That's I didn't brush good. my teeth either. Honestly, dude, that it's just ah, it feels so cathartic to do that. You know what I mean? I don't know what it is. Yeah. I love being super drunk and just passing out, and then waking up and feeling all the puffy, the cloudy cloudiness on your on your uh, gums. Yeah, you like that? No, I hate it actually. Yeah, it's actually terrible. Yeah, but two week longest I've gone. Damn. Wait. Uh, how many of these stories do you have? Too many. Too many, Kiss. Just one too many. Hold on. I'm I wish I could just recall them all. I've, I, I, I just I always have a really bad memory. Sexy Dave, two weeks longest is gone without a shower. Yeah, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's a good, um... Yeah. That was a stinky yeah, butt. Yeah, it's hard to I'm gonna, I'm gonna go down the street and start a new life. Let them go home with. What, what is he talking about? I'm gonna live in this hot tub. Is there a hot tub down the street? My kid self so fucked around and found. It. My lights just flashed. Yeah, me too. Actually, <laughs> did it really? Oh, oh shit! Mine just ha it just happened again. Oh shit! Jerry. God damn it, I really don't want to lose power. It's been happening all day, too, and it's making me very nervous. I could do the Donald Duck invitation in voice chat. I, I don't typically do... It, typically, the Discord is just limited to Check Dio and Singer, if Singer's around. But hey, I can turn voice chat on in Warframe, and you can do it. <laughs> Hold on, let me see. Let me turn that on. Is now a good time to post another clip of that pastor who can't stop talking about cum? I'm sure. I guess. I mean, it's never not a bad time to talk about cum. You know? Let's see here. It's always good. It's always a good time to talk you about You have to ask. Yes, it is a lifestyle choice. Okay. Yes, it is. Oh, All shit. Right, you can't see it when I'm watching because I... Manning, you said that Starbucks was putting semen of the sodomites in their coffee, <laughs> but here's the interesting part, because it, quote, it flavors up the coffee, and it makes you think you're having a good time, which then makes me wonder, do you equate drinking semen with a good time? Well, you know, you're, you're pushing me up in a little bit of a corner here now, Jink, because I have to be very cautious here. But let me, in, my, in, in all precautions that I can exercise here now, say that well, you know a number of people think that semen tastes good a number of people think <laughs> that drinking semen is a good idea and do you see not... it that way no and i don't think that myself personally but i'm just giving you the references of what other people and think. that's just the way you've described it in uh, your past sermons <laughs> but okay continue well, so, okay, so if, if a number of people, I mean, you've got literally millions of people around the world who really think that, you know, the taste of, of semen is quite uh, in, uh, a, a, a flavor, and they seek it in the midst of other kinds of activities. And so one would think, well, all right, okay, well, start with one, not one would think, Starbucks has to do that, listen, you know, in an ingenious way, I would say, that were more and more than infamous ingenious way, they've discovered that since people like semen, and there's so many people drinking it from one another, their body fluids, why not put it in our coffees and flavor up our coffees? Well, Pastor that, Manning, I'm getting a sense here overall. They have the same experience with semen in, the, in their lattes as they have in their bedrooms late at night. 
So, Pastor Manny, I'm getting a sense for overall from your descriptions here that you, you think that being gay is a lifestyle choice, so it's a choice that a lot of people would want to make. You think that semen is delicious to a lot of people, <laughs> and, and these are choices that people make. So it seems like perhaps if it wasn't for the Bible and the teachings of Moses, etc., <laughs> that, that you might have been tempted by those choices as well. Uh, <laughs> is, that, is that the case? Have you been tempted? Oh, absolutely. No, 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 no doubt about it. You know, uh, Jenk, I spent three and a half years oh in prison. Uh, and uh, I tell you that I saw a lot of that activity going on in in prison. I mean, it was ju it was just the order of the day. It was a par for the course. I was in one prison. I was in down in um, in, in Rayford, Florida, <laughs> called Union Correctional Facility, uh, where the average sentence back in the 19, late 70s, when I was there in that prison, the average sentence, Jink, this is no lie, was 100 years. I mean, judges threw out 100 year sentence prison prison sentences old people. Like it was okay, like ordering breakfast at McDonald's. And they formed unions. The first same-sex marriage I saw was a marriage of a, a, a sodomite named Bahamas Mama who had dyed his hair red and used to walk around in white shorts, tight as you could possibly be in a halter top. And one Saturday out on the, on the yard, you know, they had a, a marriage. He got married to one of the inmates and all the other inmates were brokenhearted because they could no longer pursue sex with him. So, yeah, I saw that and, and was, was, was tempted, but I didn't yield to temptation, by the way. I, you need to know that. I mean, sure <laughs> and he's gay. Yeah. he's gay. He's I gay. He's gay. Yeah. He's I gay. He's gay. Come yeah. on. There's no way. That guy's gay. That guy wants to drink cum. He drinks his own cum. That's bullshit. Who is he trying to fool? Okay. Also, also by the way, though. What a fucking slow news day on that. On yeah. That I, I have to say, though, like, real quick. Really? I fucking hate the Young Turks. I, I hate this fucking show. I'm sorry. There was a guy yeah. that I worked with that always watched these fucking people. And I, I I fucking hate this. I hate I hate them. I don't know what their political leaning is. I don't give a shit about that. I just hate listening to them. I have to say. That was funny, though. That was a funny interview. Jerry, I agree. <laughs> He's trying to debate him into talking about drinking cum. And that's fucking awesome. But fuck those people. Okay, sorry. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, that's also like, who is this guy? Why is he? Who? Who's? Who's? Who's this gentleman? The guy drinking cum. Yeah, the guy. The semen. He's guy. just some he? pastor that I guess has like a public broadcast show that I think like. And he got famous by talking about drinking cum. <laughs> I don't know. He must have had some following. Dude, if he got famous talking about drinking cum, I think he's pretty cool. I mean. What are we doing wrong, right? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. It, we're, we're drinking cum all the time over here. I don't know. Do we need to just talk about drinking cum more? Oh, my God. I don't know. Are we... Are we? Here's the thing. I don't think I know a single person in the world. If someone... Hey, can someone legitimately tell me, is there someone, anyone in the world who legitimately enjoys the taste of cum? Because I, I don't think... I think it's more of a tolerable thing, not like a... Yeah, I'm into drinking cum. You know, I don't. I think even the ones who don't mind cum don't even don't still don't really like cum though. They just don't do you mind think, like, it. Do you think like it just depends on like you know who it's coming out of? Like how kinky they are. Oh, oh. You know what I mean? Like maybe I, just everyone like you know like a like you know a guy from like Pakistan probably has a different flavor than a guy from like Cambodia. Or I something, do cultural you know? cum. Yeah, cultural differences in cum definitely. You know. Definitely. Pro probably some of that, right? Oh yeah. Here's the thing. I know my cum probably does not taste the best because my diet sucks. You know. Like, what do you think Nicaraguan cummies taste like? I don't. Did I tell you about one of my coworkers though who? Uh, so, okay, there was, we, uh, when I, when I worked at the burger restaurant, right, uh, I had a co-worker who, who started dating, uh, one of the girls that worked there, and, um, anyways, they My broke up. tastes like marble. <laughs> <laughs> yours tastes like a jewel, uh, Virginia tobacco flavor. That's what yours tastes like. <laughs> Sorry, go ahead. Um, okay, anyways. They broke up. A couple broke up, and the girl started talking shit with my girlfriend. And so, um, uh, she told my girlfriend that this guy's cum was like cottage cheese. Like, it was so, like, thick. Thick like cottage cheese. Oh. 
and like tasted horribly. And that's because his diet consisted of all fast food and like McDonald's, Burger King, Taco Bell. Like that's all he ever ate. Wait, so she she's, she's like tested that then? Well, she she I mean I think she's gotten around. I think she sucked other wieners and jizzed, you know, and tasted other people's jizz. So she, ha she well, I think she had a. Huh? She like did she like suck off like a vegan guy and was it like better? I don't know. I say I didn't. I, I don't know. I don't think Ivy Isabel is still friends with her really. So I you know. <gasps> could could have legit had a bad STD. The thing is, is that he was only ever intimate with one other person before her. So, I don't know. Maybe, maybe, yeah, maybe she cheated and had an STD, so. I don't know. Mm, I don't know. Come to her, huh? The thing is, I do think your, your diet does play a big role in your cum. So, probably the viscosity okay. of it and, like, how watery, you know. I mean, that's what viscosity is, but you know what I'm now, saying. Now, Jerry, so. you've talked, you've talked at nauseum before about oh, yes. pineapple cummies not being an effective task. I've, for I've read cummies. it. I've read it based on that, like, you would have to ingest a lot of pineapple and not just 24 hours before you know you're going to nut, but, like, the entire, like, month or, like, week, you'd have to have a shit ton of wow. pineapple. You'd have to spend a month eating pineapple to get like pineapple something comes? And, like, you know, juice, chunks, whole, you know, all of it, so. Wow. It also works if you stick the entire pineapple up your ass, too. I guess. <laughs> so. <laughs> oh, shit. I don't know. Like I'm Five in a row? Know. Damn, Max. Jesus. Yeast infection makes your cum. Oh, Goofy Goober's now following. <laughs> hey, Goober. Thank you. That's me in another kitchen punching frozen burritos. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, yes, yes, a it, yeast no, infection can cause changes in the texture and appearance of semen, giving it a cottage cheese-like consistency. Is sperm that looks like cottage cheese a sign of an STI? While it can be a symptom of certain STIs, it's important to consult with a healthcare professional for an accurate diagnosis. Oh my god. So you don't How think do you, you like just had thick cum? Oh. I guess so. Ricotta cheese, oh my god. I've been eating cottage cheese lately. <laughs> you think if I ate enough of that, I'd get cottage cheese my, cummies? Like, uh, like, this is so horrible, but my first initial reaction was to ask if you're gay. <laughs> For eating cottage cheese? <laughs> eating cottage cheese? <laughs> <laughs> He's eating cottage cheese. <laughs> Are you gay? <laughs> <laughs> well, um, it has good uh, protein co no, yeah. content. No, yeah. I don't know. So. There's nothing bad about it. I, I probably could get into it too because you know me. So, yeah, I've been uh, putting some salt and pepper on. It's pretty good. Oh, you're eating it on like that. Food. You're not doing like yeah. fruit and shit. No, no. Yeah, I just put it on a uh, some toast and eat it. <sighs> gay. I eat it as gaily as possible too. Yeah, that's funny. Hi. Um. Okay, guys. I'm gonna. I don't know what this guy's doing, so I'm gonna reinvite you guys. Um. Anyways. Well, that's good to know. Yeah. Um. Hold on. Just to be sure. Thank you, crackheads. Um, my cum tastes so good, the local Starbucks puts it in their coffee as a creamer. That's crazy. Whoa. What was that? Um, anyways. Oh, that's Louie. I did activate in-game. We can hear you. I can hear you. I can also hear myself, though, in the speakers. Listening to myself <laughs> talk about cum. You can't hear the game. Well, maybe you can. 
This is weird. Can you hear me? Oh, my God. I can hear you doing the Donald Duck voice. Can we get a rainbow flag emote with a stock image of cottage cheese on it? I think that's a pretty good idea. <laughs> All right, I'm going to turn off voice chat just because I can hear your speaker in the back, but we did. He I heard the Donald Duck voice. That is funny. No, you're good. That's funny. Yeah, should I title the one called this stream called Donald Dunk Drinks Come? Okay, I can turn it off. Okay. That is a very good Donald Duck impersonation, though. Um, okay, I have... Here's a legit question. Okay, then we're gonna, we're moving away from cum, okay? All right, check deal. Are you ready? Oh, wait, are you still there? You might be drinking cum. Yes. Oh, yeah. Are you still there? What's going on? Okay, I here's a legit question. This is for everybody. I guess, I guess sorry, I was distracted by gay thoughts. What's going oh. on? <laughs> You're thinking about Matt Damon again? <laughs> I knew you were thinking about Matt Damon. <laughs> what's, going, what's going on? Um, all right. This okay. What do you classify as a poor person chip? We were talking last stream about Tito's and how oh, I always thought that those were poverty chips. But what I don't know even know what classifies a poverty chip. What is a poverty chip? I don't even know. But what do you? It's hockey. Oh yeah, Takis definitely. I was gonna say Baconettes or Takis. Baconettes, whoa. Yeah. I don't even, fuck, do people even, oh my god, Baconettes. You really, Lay's Original, you think, Ry uh, Ryan? You think Lay's, Lay's Original? Lay's Originals are like kind of fucking kind of, expensive. Yeah, I feel like that's like a good little like party kind of cheaper. I yeah, think two probably bucks for some bacon nets, and like they're not really like that amazing either. Bugles. I f uh, I feel like bugles are kind of fun though. I yeah I think they're I think they're it's like a poverty really, chip. They're like delicious, is it? Yeah. Uzis? I've never heard of that. What one. is Uzis? Paper. <laughs> Get says paper. Yeah, put some salt on it. <laughs> paper. <laughs> Um, uh, yeah, Funyun, Funyuns, I would say, is pretty poverty, but really man, good. I love Funyuns. Yeah, they just, they just seem just trashy. That's know? some juggalo. Yeah, okay, it's a trashy yeah, it chip. Really yeah, maybe trashy. maybe that's a better thing to ask is maybe not poverty or poor person, but like like trashy. Trashy. What's a trashy chip? Max said Cheetos. I'm surprised by that one. I feel like that's a kid. That's a kid. It's like a kid's chip. Kids. Yeah, kids are kids chip. Or, uh, oh, I do know what this is. Yeah, actually, Kiss, I, I was just about to say that. Kiss, I think Doritos do cross the line of trashiness a lot. For some reason to me. I don't know why. I don't, I've never even seen these. Okay, maybe I haven't seen any of these either. I have no idea. Is this like a Midwest thing? Because they got different stuff out there. Yeah, they do. It's a ghetto kid chip. Those fuckers cheap and delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Dur wow. See, everything that I thought was like... I'm... Th okay. See, everything you guys are saying is like name brand. You recognize it. You know what a Dorito is. You know what a Cheeto is. You know what Lay's is. I would not think that that's like a trashy thing because it's so well known. I was thinking more like... Yeah, like Bugles. Uh, like Funyuns. Um, what? Uh, what? What? Ma well, hold on a second. What makes a bugle uh, kind of like trashy to you? I think because they were cheaper than all the other ones, and they kind of just have like this taste of like bo and like kind of like hatred in them. Bo and hatred, huh? Yeah, I don't know. Like that Wait, nacho the, cheese oh, one. Man, I like. I never buy those. I should. 
Actually, you know what? One time you guys bought a bag of bugles and like I couldn't fucking eat them because they were so goddamn salty. Uh, they're very like, usually, salty. Usually, I'm like I'm good with salt, but they're like there's like no way I could have eaten those. Walmart. And I don't remember them was... ever being that salty before. Yeah. Okay, how about this one? And I first of all, I want to I want to preface this by saying I absolutely love these, and they these are an underrated like top five for me, and like I don't think a lot of people agree with this. But this is a classic chip, and they're never bad. They're boring, but they're never bad. But I think they're kind of a poverty chip. Fritos. Yeah, dude, you're fucking totally right. That is such a poverty chip right there. Oh, my God. But, I, just, dude, I bought a that. bag of this. It's good. It's oh, really good. Oh, man, I, man, I used to eat so many of these, the twists ones. Oh, or like the, the honey barbecue. barbecue. Yeah, I fucking ate so many of those in high school. What about the chili cheese one? Chili challenge. Sriracha hot. Chili I sauce. Had but yeah, man, I man, I, was, I don't think I ever want to eat those ever again. Oh really? Life. See, I didn't. I took. Uh, yeah, see, we would always get those in our lunch, and I got sick of them too. And then it's been a long time, and I got them recently. I was like, oh yeah, I like these. I like these a lot, actually. If you think about it, that's a really good chip because it's so dense, right? Like, yeah. that'll keep you full for a while. Oh, yeah. And feeling like shit for longer. And there's no soy in it. Oh. It's corn. Hold on a second. Bark Bark brought up Orangina. That's a drink. That is. Here, uh, Orangina. That's like, isn't that from, like, France? I don't know if I've had it. I was gonna say if we're if we're moving on to drinks, I'm gonna say Arizona iced tea is like pretty poverty. Just poverty. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. it's pretty poverty. I love it though, but yeah, it's it's poverty as fuck. Orange giant. Yeah, I, I don't know if I I don't know if I've ever seen this drink. In I don't think I have States. either. Sunny D. Oh yes. Oh, yeah, Sunny D. Sunny D. What is oh fuego? Oh, oh yeah, fuego. I don't think I've ever had that either. I, I haven't either. Oh wait. Also, also like. Capri Sun's kind of. Capri Sun like, sucks. That, or like, what is this? Fago? You're on food stamps if you're drinking Capri Sun. <laughs> I fucking hate Capri Suns, honestly. Actually, the lemonade Capri Sun's pretty good. But it's been a long time since I've had it. Sunny Dick. Anyways, yeah, that uh, just something I thought about is a poverty chip. Wow, we just got a Saren Pro Who the fuck opened this? Was this you, Kiss? <coughs> Who the hell had this? Holy shit. Damn. Saw those old videos of Capri Sun with the mold at the bottom? What? Ew. I'm yeah, I'm trying to suck down some Danimals. I still want to freeze a Gogurt and bite the middle of it, you know? Yes, you should do. Actually, you should actually for your next stream, you should buy a bunch of gogurts yeah. and just start, just go, just run through them with like streaming them into your mouth like just that. Just make like a that, fucking that same mess. handlebar method. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you got people. You got to <laughs> teach people that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's fucking awesome. Frozen gogurt is frozen goat gurt. I'm about to fucking do it. <laughs> Yogurt. Yogurt. Um, well, anyways. Alright, what else do I have written down here? Now that we covered that. Oh, shit. That was loud as fuck. Bark Bark, you gotta choose my loadout, but I don't think you know shit about Warframe. Alright, choose my loadout, Bark Bark. You spent a lot of points on that one. You get to choose my loadout in Warframe. Dengus Prime? Ah, oh, fuck, dude. I don't have Dengus Prime. <laughs> you, have to, you have to choose my pri my Warframe, my primary weapon, my secondary weapon, and my melee weapon. I don't have Dengus Prime, though. <laughs> Maybe, I, actually, I wonder if I can refund him those points. Let me see if I can do that, actually. I always forget how you do this. I don't actually know. Oh, wait. Review, request, review. Okay. Bark, bark. Keep an eye out on your 
channel chatter points and see if they get let me re refund boy okay did that just give you back your points <laughs> just spent it again. All right. Well, I guess it gave it back. Okay. <laughs> now did they? <laughs> well, fuck. All right. God damn it. I don't have Dengus Prime. I don't know what Dengus is. Fuck me. Well, I don't know. So, they should really make a frame though called Dengus Prime though. Make yeah, sure. I'm playing Dengus Prime right now, and I've just got this big old slong, and I'm over here stroking my shit. You just want oh, to test. Oh, Jerry, let me. Yeah. I want to tell you. Um, yeah. So, actually, this is for everyone to to know. This is this is awesome. YouTube has free movies. Yeah. You didn't know that. So, if you're looking for something to watch, and you're you know, you canceled all your Netflix and your Prime and your Hulu and everything. You know, you're just trying to go off the grid. YouTube YouTube has you covered. And they have some good movies on there, and I want to. Here's uh, here's two. I'm gonna recommend right off the bat to you that you can okay, watch me, right let me, now. Let me see if I let me get my notes out. Okay, number one, you should go watch The Professional. It's an excellent film. It's with uh, a really really young Natalie Portman. Oh wait, I thought that was Leon that, The Professional. Yeah, I think it's just called The Professional on YouTube though. But you need oh. everyone should watch this film. It's ex it's excellent. It has a huge cult following. It's a wonderful film. Um, Can I tell you some fucked and, up something? And it about has that? a. Who's that guy who played like a uh, like a dwarf? Gary Oldman. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, he's the bad guy in the movie, and he just it. He just fucking kills it. I'm yeah. maybe I'm hyping it up too much, but it's a, it's a great film. You should check it out. The ne Scorpion. Yami, how are you? Oh wait, he wants me to do 420. Shit. Hold on. Okay, go ahead. Um, the next one. That I would probably watch before The Professional because The Professional is a better movie. But Artificial Intelligence, AI Artificial oh, yeah. Intelligence, is is, uh, is free to watch on YouTube right now. And that's also a spectacular film. Did you, did you finally make it through that movie? I finally did, yes. <laughs> After You're, all of these Yeah, years. we've like never finished that one. Um, and so I'll t let me tell you the premise of it. It's about, it's about AI, which, you know, is kind of... Uh, What's with it's uh, with the times, and it's about um, a family going through strife, and a company. Uh, they they are they are losing their child, so to handle the grief, they get an AI kid, and uh, just it just what a crazy fucking story. I don't think I don't think storytelling has <laughs> done something like this before. So yeah. it's fun. It's a fun movie. Might be a little uh, cheesy and ooey gooey, and maybe Ooh. a little far fetched for some if you're more based in the logical world but uh i i recommend it david yeah david. Sure they're gonna see that again yeah bark bark it's it's an excellent watch i really enjoyed it yeah it's, it's a sad movie though i dude it that movie fucked sad. me up as a kid i remember crying like a little bitch well i don't know if i cried but it made me want to cry it is sad yes it is exactly Kiss, <laughs> yeah. Off-brand Black Mirror episode, perfect way to put it. But um, I don't know. I really like that movie. Uh, I also watched uh, Transcendence, which is free on there too. Oh, what That's is that with, one? That's another AI movie with Johnny Depp. Oh. And uh, like, yeah. Uh, premise of that one is this this guy oh, mathematician. I was to see this. He's he's dying. And uh, they want to basically put his brain in a computer. Morgan Freeman! And Morgan Freeman's in it. And I recommend this one as, as well. Listen, I, I love all sci-fi sort of mind-bender movies that kind of get you, like, uh, kind of get you thinking a little bit. That's always my, my jam. Yeah, even if people say it's shit, I usually end up, like, finding something that I enjoy about it. Right. Yeah, you don't have to like the whole entire movie, but like, you know, it'll just like just leaves you with some questions and stuff and maybe like kind of contemplating a little <laughs> bit. I think it's good. Right on, Max. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Oh my god. Scorpion, you have to choose my loadout. 
You have to choose my frame, my primary, my secondary, and my melee. And I'll use it for a couple of missions or so. Yes, that is another good... I haven't seen that in a while, um, Ryan. I should, I should watch that again. Yeah, I don't have Dengus Prime. Jerry, why don't you have Dengus? We gotta get Dengus I Prime. don't have Dengus Prime. I, uh, Dr. Steve took the Dengus and... Dude, he spent like, he spent like a thousand, like, thousand like CP calm. on that, dude. I know, dude. I don't know how many exactly things in that. You don't have a Dengus Prime, dude? Gore Queen herself? Is that... Oh, fuck. Garuda? Okay, Scorpion, I will do that. We queued for this mission, but I... Okay, Garuda, Soma, Bolter, and Talons. Okay. Sounds good. Okay, yeah, just to just to reiterate. All those movies I said, they're free to watch right now, so... Fucking get on free. It. It's free. Put it on YouTube while you're jerking off in bed on your belly, and then sleep. Let's see, we've been watching... We fucking powered through... The Lord of the Rings thing. We watched that way too fast. We watched the Two Towers. We watched Return of the King. And then now we're watching The Hobbit. We're already on the second Hobbit movie. That's what we've been doing during the snowstorm thing. Um, That's good. I know I talked to shit. Uh, I talked a lot about Lord of the Rings and stuff last stream. But I wanted to say, uh, after we're done with watching through The Hobbit and stuff, we're going to watch Underworld. Because I've never seen those movies. Oh, yes. I think I, I mentioned watching that like a few streams ago and you I, did. I, I, I haven't seen, i haven't seen all the series but i watched the first one and i did and i enjoyed it it was, it was, I, uh, it was yeah. it's cheesy but i want to like, watch if you just want that matrix 2000s vibe oh, yeah. dude that movie i did it yeah killer clowns from outer space is also free on youtube i don't hmm i don't know if i've ever heard of that oh, shit um, that's it's a shitty like horror movie and like from like the fifties or something like that, sixties. No, earlier than that maybe. Hmm. Um, Kiss is fucking with you. <laughs> Unir uh, but I think Kiss unironically enjoys that movie. Oh, it's from the eighties. I don't know. It's from the eighties. Um. Anyways. Um. Hey, something I didn't know, r just real quick about The Hobbit. I did not know that, um, I do not know how I missed this originally watching through those movies. I watched those movies twice now. This is my third time watching through them. And, um, I am such a dumbass, and I always thought that The Hobbit, like, yeah, it had some of the same characters that were in Lord of the Rings and stuff like that, but I didn't know that it actually had anything to do with, uh, Sauron and the ring and stuff like that. I thought it was mostly just a focus on the dwarfs. But I didn't realize that there is actually this whole other story going on where this necromancer and this dark energy is being felt throughout the lands, which is actually the return of Sauron. So I'm a dumbass, and I'm just now realizing that now watching through it. Um, so, yeah, fuck me. So um, I'm enjoying The Hobbit so now, though, because of understanding that. And I wish there was more of that instead of this focus on the dwarves, but, it, oh, you know, it's whatever. The second movie was a filler. But anyways, go ahead. What were we going to say? No, I mean, I need to, I need to see those. Um, actually, I started The Hobbit, oh, sometime last year. And I, we didn't we didn't finish it for some reason, but I, I, I do want to see it. They're definitely not as good as Lord of the Rings, so it's kind of, I understand why you wouldn't, but, you know. You should. I mean, honestly, fun. honestly, I feel like I was enjoying The Hobbit more than I was the oh. original series. Oh wow, you're controversial. So, and the I stream just froze. Oh, okay, never mind. Uh, I also tried watching the Amazon series, but and man, I don't know. My girlfriend oh, I heard and I tried to watch bad. it. It was just, it was just. I heard what that was the real, fuck? Real but... bad. Oh, Death Note is free on. Yes, that is. I highly recommend that. So well. much. What was any secondary? Oh, okay. Um, Soma or Bolter Talons. I'm going to use the Soma. I didn't realize that most of those movies were already mapped out and written by the time Peter Jackson came in as a director, which explains... Oh, I didn't know that either, Bark Bark. Really? That's kind of sad. That's really sad. 
Um, Louis, I'm... Louis, I will miss you. Oh, Louis, are you out of here? Me Tango. Okay, all right. <laughs> okay, hey, have a good night. Thank you for joining. I know you, you don't have to join this mission, this guy. Oh, wait, and you also... What do I think about your mod config? Wait, Jerry, are you using the talents? I am. I'm using the talents. Okay, good. I mean, this looks good. Are you just using the Archon stuff because of... Uh, uh. Louis, you may not need Empower on there, but I understand why you're using it, but... I think your build looks fine. You know, Rhino is a pretty, uh, you know, simple one to shit. A simple one to take a shit with. Yeah. Suck my dick, bitch. Fuck. Or no, that's not to Louie. I'm just saying suck. Fuck. Oh, you, dude, you need yeah. that sound clip. What is that from? That's from uh, the Talk Shit Hotline. Oh, suck my dick, bitch. Fuck you. Yeah, okay. That is yeah, a, you okay, need that right, one. Right, that's a really that good down. one. Um, uh, yeah. there, I, dude, I've been watching this show called Orphan Black. Oh, yeah. The it's good. jail one with the uh, women. Yeah, uh... No, that's Orange is the New Black. Oh, what are you... <laughs> what are you watching again? Orphan Black. Uh, why are you putting so much emphasis on the black part? I'm not, I swear. Oh, okay. I just, it, I stuttered. Or something. <laughs> something happened to me. Maybe an aneurysm? So, what is that uh, about? It's about uh, this lady, and she's kind of a sack of shit, and, but she finds out she has a bunch of clones, and she's trying to figure out, like, how to, you know, what, like, all of the, the clones are doing, like, having sex with each other and shit, oh. you know, like, they're, like, fingering and busting. The clones are having sex and busting? Yeah, yeah they're, like, you know, like, <laughs> greasing up and, like, slipping around and shit, you know, like. With, like, they're greasing each other up and sla sliding around? Yeah, they're like slapping and like there's like a cabbage at some point and maybe like, you know, some fruit that they're just smashing on each other's heads. <laughs> Wait, where does the cabbage, when did the cabbage come in? Well, I don't know. That's what we're trying to figure out. It's a plot of the show. When the yeah, so, I don't know, it's pretty good. <laughs> um, <laughs> waiting to see, waiting to see how it, uh... <laughs> how it turns yeah, you out. Yeah, let us know what happens when that cabbage yeah, comes I'll, into play. I'll tell you. Well, I'll give you an update. Wait, so it. what is that show about? It's about a lady and she finds out she has like a bunch of clones. And there's no slapping? Uh, oh, dude, there's some there's some slapping in there. I mean, just tell you. There's, there's some slapping in <laughs> You're there. You're making me kind of want to watch <laughs> this show. Yeah, but it's it's cool. It takes place in Canada. Oh, Canada. You like Canada? Yeah. So. Yeah, it's good. I don't know. I don't. I've i maybe seen three, four episodes, maybe. So I'm not. I'm still fresh. I'm still fresh. Still trying to get the plot. You're kind of good about consuming media. I've been like not watching shit. Yeah. Yeah. Besides Lord of the Rings stuff, but. No, yeah, I guess, yeah, I, I do, I watch a lot of shit lately, I just, usually, like, I don't, I just, you know what I mean, like, I just, I like watch, like, YouTube mainly. That's kind of what I do, too. I think I'm just so just ADHD like lately, I just play fucking video games, till I, like, pass out. Check the, uh, reminded me of... Let's check this out. This? Am I allowed to watch this? For breakfast, we'll do something cool, like have a cigarette <laughs> and like a yeah, bar of chocolate. That's fine. And then we go for work for like one half hour, two half <laughs> hour. And then we'll go for lunch. And lunch is usually, you know, something cool, like a cigarette and like <laughs> two, three bottles of red wine and then like a bowl of heavy cream. And then dinner, you know, we'll do something healthy, like, uh, you know, four or five sausages and then like a chocolate cigarette. And then we'll invite our cigarette outside to take an espresso and watch the street life. <laughs> and we so much can eat as much as we want and we never get heavy because of olive oil. So that's what we say. That's For funny. breakfast, we'll do some... Because <laughs> olive oil? Because uh, of olive oil? Yes. Bowl that's of heavy oil. cream. That's, isn't that, that's Lance Crawl, right? Nick. Nick. Oh, Nick Crawl? Nick Crawl. Wow, that could yeah. be that could I be really that. bad. What I just did right there. Um, 
Sorry. Uh, hmm? That was good. <laughs> right on. It's excellent. Let's open this one. I always think that voice that we do is like like a Dutch guy or something. You I always think it's like almost like almost like could be like a Russian guy too. If like oh yeah, I, no, I don't know. Invigor invite our cigarettes outside. I like invite the cigarette outside with the heavy whipping cream and a chocolate cigarette. You just Rick rolled me. <laughs> just Rick rolled me. It's such a fucking good song, dude. Dude, I wish I could set up that karaoke stuff. We'd sing a little karaoke going. Oh, dude, you have a good Randy Newman. Pretty lady. Dude, dude, I see trees. Oh, that's um, that's um, Louis Armstrong. Oh, Louis Ar you have a good Louis Armstrong. Fuck, how does that song go? Let me look at the lyrics here. Uh, what is this? What a wonderful... It's a, that's, I kind of, that hurts doing that voice. Louis Armstrong. Okay, you don't, you don't have to do it. You don't have to do, do it. it. Don't fuck yourself up. I'm don't gonna do yourself. it. Okay, wait, here we okay. go. I see trees of green, red roses too. I see them bloom for me and you, and I think to myself, what a wonderful. I mean, that's like. That's really on point, dude. There you go. That kind of hurts, though. I think I think uh, maybe you you need to you need to start a cover band or something. Dude, I'm gonna start yeah. a TikTok doing um shoot and come. <laughs> <laughs> Check out my fucking new TikTok, guys. I'm gonna be shooting comes and gyms on there. Yeah, guys, go to my only or go to my TikTok and watch me shoot come. I mean, there's already like softcore porno on there already, right? Or some shit. I mean, shit. It basically, is right? Isn't TikTok just like a, like a weird, porn website? That's basically. like a weird, like kind of like softcore, like fucking. I don't know, like, I don't know what's going on. That's probably like some jail Look at bait. Me. I'm fucking, dancing. Like, I'm dancing. Chris Hansen, <laughs> NBC News shit on there. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Some fucking scary stuff on going on in there. Yeah. yeah, just fucked up shit. Just fucked up. Fucked up fucking shit i can like clip my fingernails with a glitter filter yeah i can wait what i get uh -huh. oh dude did you did you see that uh that motor motorcycle lady that went viral in japan and it, it's just like a really thin like japanese guy with a filter on <laughs> and he's oh. like mega famous maybe he's like and it's like he the filter makes him look like a really like you know cute like Japanese girl, <laughs> and then he, then he put, I think like someone saw someone saw him one day at like a restaurant, and they like took a photo of him. And they're like, "Wait, is this is this the same person?" <laughs> Shit, no, I haven't. <laughs> he's like he's like in his fifties. He's like oh, a fifty-year-old wow. like leathery guy. Wait, Paul, you know? What do I? He's like real fit. What do I type in? Japanese. What did you say? Japanese motorcycle girl, girl guy filter. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's on the BBC. This guy. Oh, this. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Look at this guy's face in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Dude, that AI shit is crazy. That's fun, isn't it? Yeah, whoa. Nice. That's fucking weird, dude. I don't know. AI shit's scary. You should do that, Jerry. What do I do? The filter? I'm pretty. I'm pretty. Yeah, dude, you should do. You should do a filter with like just a like girl face. Actually, I happens. have done it before, and it's weird because my fucking chin is so big and like my head is so square that I don't. You can still kind of tell. Really? You can kind of tell. Yeah. How do I do that? Is there a way to? 
AI girl oh, filter. No. Let me just start clicking on some websites that are going to be fucking fucking me up here. Swap gender now. Yes. 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 Swap my gender right now. Get rid of it. Oh, I have to upload an image. Okay. Hold on. How do I... Here. Oh, let me see if I can do this. I'm about to come out. Oh. Fuck. Hold on. This is gonna be this is gonna be kind of a shitty image. Let me see if this works. Okay, start the process. I'm starting the process. Dude, I'm high res now. Oh, wait. Wait, this isn't doing anything. How do I do? It's on TikTok, right? Do I, I mean, I do wait, have I TikTok. You do, you're going you're, you're gonna to live broadcast your, your face womanized? No, I don't think I can. Oh. I wanted to swap my gender now. Oh, wait, That's gender filter. Okay, wait, hold on, let's see. <laughs> it's upload, it's processing, 50%. Oh. <laughs> okay, hold on. <laughs> Fuck, hold on, I gotta finish this mission. Oh shit, I'm always behind because I'm getting distracted here. I'm kind of ugly. Oh my god. All right. Anyways, I mean that's not uh, she's not ugly, but okay. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Let me find the original image here. Okay. This is the picture that I took. Right here's my face. Okay. Okay, and this is what this website uh, made for me. Okay, you ready? Let's see. What? Yeah, I don't think that really works. It seems like they just made this image. This is just an image that already existed. Let's take another picture. I'm going to take another picture. I'm going to be I'm going to do a cute face, okay? That's my wife, dude. <laughs> she does Wait, maybe it's cuz the headphones. I'm going to take the headphones off, okay? Oh, my eyes, or my lights just flickered. Okay, hold on. Fuck, hold on. <laughs> okay, hold on. Okay. I got fucking Nazi hair. Um, <clears throat> or huh? Okay, let's see. We're gonna upload this in. Oh wait, I gotta fucking go to paint again. I didn't know you were Cherokee. Oh my god. What? Oh, Max. <laughs> Being offensive. Um. All right, we're 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 processing. Okay, hold on. We're processing. We're doing a gender filter. We're going female. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see. It's giving me the same. It's like the same woman. It is. It's like it's. I think it's. It's trying to tell you something. I think you're gonna see this lady in your dreams, and she's gonna like strangle you or something. Dude, she's gonna kill me. Yeah. It's gonna be like Minority Report. Kind of looks like um, like that Aston girl. Oh yeah, yeah. Ugh. 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 I don't know about this one, Jer. Yeah. Okay. Let let me let me go to TikTok. Let me go to TikTok. You play piano. You want to? <laughs> oh, 
Not only do I play piano, but I have over 150 different farts noises for you. Okay, I have I have a lot. Yes. Oh, we play piano over here. Club to death. I don't know if you can. All right. That's okay. fucking awesome. Okay. That is in farts, though. Um, look at those fingers. Yeah, you like those sausages? Yeah, that's what I, When I eat Taco Bell, I can play a whole fucking. whole deadly coming out of my ass. What am I opening here? Oh, wait. I was going to go to TikTok. Okay. I don't know how to use you know TikTok. What, you know what I just looked up uh, recently? I looked up a. Uh, Kesha. Oh, why is that? Tick tock. Let it rock. Let the cream pie come. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let my cream pie come. Um, what am, okay, what do I look up? Disco, uh, girl. Boy to girl? Or gender? Only fingies. <laughs> gender swap? Ah, yes. Yes. Yes, Jerry definitely has an only fingies. That's so hell yeah. Oh, that's a okay. That's not. Hold on. Wait, 1930s look. I don't want that. Probably shouldn't have started this mission because I'm. Yes, Kesha was the trashier British. She was a little more fun, though. You know, I heard she got stiffed by a record label or something. She got really... That's why her, you don't hear from her much. But, man, she had so many hits. It's crazy. This is anime, Jerry. Hold on. Fuck. I'm not going to be able to show this. This is... TikTok, a... feel the cock. I'm trying to sleep. There you go. That's anime, Jerry. Sexy anime, Jerry. Wow, Jer. Do you want to have sex with me? You look like a Overwatch hero or something. Dude. I'm a... Oh, shit. Did I just post that? Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Hold on. Wait. They're fucking extracting and I'm not doing the mission. Oh, fuck. <laughs> did, you, did, you, did you post? Did you no, post I don't that? think I did. <laughs> They're like, wow, this is the first guy's first guy first guy to post, huh? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah. It goes, like, a... it goes viral. Who is a this woman? woman? Yeah. Oh, did you draw this? Yeah, dude. I did. Okay, hold on. Alright, okay. Uh, I have, to, I, I have to step away for a second. I gotta check my, uh... Make sure your fucking wall okay. isn't bursting. <laughs> yeah, I gotta check it. I'll be right back. Okay. Uh, alright. I do want to keep fucking with this AI thing. I want to find one that actually makes me, um... Like, uh, not like a cartoon or something, though. Like an actual, like, woman. I want to be- I want to be a woman! Make me a woman! Make me a woman right now! Okay, hold on. Kiss? Kiss, you gotta bear with me here. Oh, wait, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. Okay. What do I look up? What was the filter? What is the- Hold on. What was that Japanese guy, girl, biker- Oh shit. Japanese guy, girl, biker. Oh, it's a face app. Never mind, I don't like that. I can't do that. Buy those giant fake tits off Amazon first step, then use filters? Probably. 
gender swap. Let me see what this one does. <laughs> this just made me a dude. This just made me a more handsome dude. Oh shit. This one, hold on. This one made me a dude. It made me like a Giga Chad, dude. Dude, I'm I'm sexy. I'm dead sexy. I'm dead sexy. Hold on, gender swap. Fuck. How do I do this? I hate TikTok. It sucks. TikTok suck cock. Uh, guys, I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. Um, this one. That just looks like a <laughs> I don't know. You can make up your mind on what that looks like. Anyways, all right. Well, that was fun. Um Which one has like the most I think I already did this one. Your purge mask? What is that? Ooh. There you go. That's like me as like an old woman. That's kind of scary. Well. All right. Did we have enough of that? That's cool. All right, kiss. I'm sorry. What are, what are we doing? Actually, I could take a pee pee. Can I take a pee pee? Let me go take a pee pee. I already wasted enough of your time, so let me go pee pee. Okay? I'll be back. Do I seem like I'm fucking around? This She got out of it. Huh? Yes. Is this Trojan? I need a Magnum Dong. Cause I'm stealing, baby. Yo, I'm gonna steal, baby. <laughs> I'm stealing, baby. Stop
That's uh, that's me at the night times watching streams. What are we doing here, Kiss? Are we uh, hanging out? Where are you? Should I go look at the corrupted hollow key guy here? Where do I go for that? Or oh, wait, is that not here? Isn't that here? That's not here. Who sells it? Let's see how many corrupted hollow keys we got. Let's go check it out. I'm down for more relics. I'm down. I'm down for brown kiss. I'm down to like fucking see that chocolate starfish of yours. I'm not even. I'm not even joking. You know. <laughs> no, I am joking. I don't need to see that. But I bet it's hairy. So no offense. Just. I know you're a man, so got that hairy ass. We all got it, you know. How do I fucking get around to... Listen, this might... You know, I... No, Kiss, I know. Well, I know. You shave your asshole, Kiss? How the fuck do you get around in this fucking... I don't think I've ever really explored this place. I don't know where the fuck I am. Who sells the shit? Is that the parent sequence? No, it's not them, is it? Oh shit, I got things to turn into, don't I? Oh yeah, is it this asshole? Oh, it is. How many? Oh, this isn't gonna... Oh, I have a hundred... Oh, wow. What do we got? We got anything good here? Magnetic. Radiation. Electricity. Any 50 percenters? Cold. <gasps> oh, heat. 45%. That's not bad. <gasps> Oh, 30% dog shit, 34% dog shit, 31% dog shit. Okay, fuck it. Reminds me of the tsunami guy, that last bump clip. Yeah, I, dude, it's hard because like, I mean, I guess I have a better camera now. I could actually probably make something like that. The guy, that was a, a, a project uh, for a college class and the guy wanted me to be the actor for his video. It's actually a really fucked up clip. It's me. We, it was a music video class, so we had to, like, make different music videos, and I was the actor for that guy's project, and his idea, he wanted to put it to John Carpenter's, like, I don't know, like, Halloween theme or something, I don't know what he, music he put it to, it wasn't Halloween theme, it was something else, and, um... It was like me murdering people. It was really fucked up. It was me murdering people and then watching the tapes back. I would record every murder and watch it back in this music video. It was kind of a fucked up thing, but uh, I don't know why he wanted me to be it. I guess I just look like a serial killer, but uh, unfortunately it's 3 a.m. and I'm a silly human who needs to sleep. You're my new favorite Warframe streamer. Much love. Hey, Raynon, thank you for joining. I hope to see more of you. You're, you're lots of fun to have, so thank you. Thank you for being here. We do it every Thursday and Sunday at 7.30 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So, thanks for thanks for showing up, dog. I hope you come back. Um, Jerry, you need a mid part. Like... I'm an emo kid, not conforming as can me. You'd be not conforming too if you look just like me. I got paint on my nails and makeup on my face. I'm almost emo enough to start shaving my legs. Cause I look real deep. When I'm dressing in drag, I call it freedom of expression. Might as well call me a... Cause it... Ch Never mind, that song's kind of offensive. I can't actually sing that song. I don't have fluffy hair. Do it, see, does it look like I'm going bald? Do you see that? Do you see that? Am I going bald? Do you see that right there? You can like really see into my skull. You know? Yeah, my hair's done for. I swear. You see you see you see how you can see into my skull? See that? Does your guys' hair look like that? You know? You see that? You see that? That should make me nervous. Okay. Anyways, um, 
I'm cute as fuck. <laughs> Uh, you should try trepan tr 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 trepanning. What is that? I should try transitioning. Tr uh, also known as or burr holing is one of the oldest <laughs> one of the oldest surgical procedures known to humanity. It refers to a surgical procedure in which a circular piece of a bone is drilled and ex ex excised. Most commonly from the human skull. Jesus kiss. What the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> oh my god. Holy shit. No. What the fuck, dude? Gives your brain some breathing room. Yeah, my brain needs to breathe. God damn. Woof. All right, anyways. Oh, what are we doing? I'm quitting? Let's quit this. Invite this bitch. Let me invite this bitch. Wait, you never asked me. You know, or you never told me about your shaved asshole. <laughs> <coughs> Jerry, thoughts on school? Um, I mean, I don't know. Like the American education system is fucked up. I guess. I think standardized testing is pretty bullshit. Um, you know, I don't know. You need it. You should stay in school. Um, I don't really know how I feel about college. I'm very mixed on that one. I, you know, I feel like we don't really live in a world anymore where a bachelor's degree means anything. But I don't think that it's... I don't think it's an unimportant goal. I think I think that if you want a bachelor's degree, I think you should do it. I think that it is important, especially if you can afford it, or if you know that you're if you're going to be doing some type of loan or something like that. If you know that you could pay it back, that you should fucking do it. But I do think that the world we live in now, I do think trade school stuff probably... There's nothing wrong with a 9 to 5, I guess. Uh, a 9 to 5 is not for me, but I don't think there's anything wrong with it. I think there's a weird thing in society to like hate your 9 to 5 and I get it. I've worked the 9 I've worked the 9 to 5, 9 to 5 and I've learned I hated it and it's not for me, but I don't think there's anything wrong with it. You know. And I don't think there's anything wrong with trying to strive to be better than the 9 to 5 too. So, you know, if you hey, if you learn that you hate the 9 to 5, do better. You know, you can always aim higher. And that's okay. You should you know, rap about Jerry, school. I've, I've yeah. been thinking about that. Yeah. Um, what if, like, 9 to 5 is just good enough for for whoever I, wants that, you know? You, I, I, I agree. I, I know it isn't for me, though. <laughs> but I, for people, I think a lot of people are told nowadays, hey, Fuck nine to five. Be a be a streamer. <laughs> Do a TikTok, and I, you know, I don't know that that. I don't think that's like a healthy thing. I don't. Yeah, I don't think it's a healthy thing. Yeah, I don't think that that it's right. There's honestly. only there's only so many entertainer people out there that can, you know, be but, yeah, that... fueled. That's the hard thing, too, is that, like, a lot of people are, like, told, like, yeah, you can do that. You can do this. And it's like, yeah, maybe you can't. You know, maybe you, maybe you shouldn't. You know? No. Yeah. But there's a chance. There is. Pursue it while you don't have any wrinkles on you. <laughs> you know? It's cool. Or, uh, missing. Never mind. Um. What? Nothing. I was gonna. Oh, uh, what? Yeah. Um. Okay. So, um. Nope. Uh, school sucks, but it's the easiest part of life. I have to agree with that one. Sometimes I really do miss the structure of just being in like fucking high school. It was so easy. You didn't you didn't worry about anything. You just woke up and fucking went to school. Oh man, you know what? Uh, I'm sorry. I'm gonna have to disagree with that. Okay. I, find, I fucking hated that. I hated it, dude. I hated. It. I, mean, I hated, I hated it every too, aspect but, of going know. to school. I don't like. I don't want to wake up. I don't want to sit there and. 
consume some shit I don't fucking really care about. <laughs> Maybe school was like more interesting, like you know, like they taught you like uh like how you know, here's how you like build a house or here's how you Taxes. Here's how you play the stock market, or here's how a credit card works, or here's how taxes yeah, are gonna cool. fuck your ass really hard. Um here's how to like here's how to talk to people. Here's would how to work on a car. Yeah, here's how to work on a car. Here's how to bake a cake. Thing is, is right? Chris makes a good point, is that you it. probably would have been bored of that, too. Yeah, probably. But I would have, like, maybe I could have, like, applied that. Yeah. You know, I don't know how a physical chemistry class has really... Ne never. Helped me out too terribly. I mean, I understand much, how but... it rained and shit, but, like, I don't fucking need to know that. Yeah, like, you know... I... I don't know. You know, I touched a sea anemone on, like, an oceanography class once, and I was like, oh, this is kind of like a boob, and that's pretty much all I got out of that <laughs> class. So, I mean, yeah. I guess, you know, I, I there were some cool books I got to, like, you know, discover. In, like, you know, Ew, you read? Class. I'm just Not kidding. really. Yeah, me either. But, uh, you know. And then I went to college and became obnoxious. Yeah, then you're like, eh. <laughs> you're like, eh. You're like, yeah. Oh, you disagree? Eh. You know? uh, oh. <laughs> I think I know a lot about this topic I'm trying to tell you about. Eh. Yeah. Let's measure our dicks. Oh, you, know, you disagree with me? Well, eh. You know? Yeah. You're just, you start making that noise a bunch. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, you, you know, I don't know. There's, I just wish, uh, Will prepared you for important things that like you didn't life. Discover on your own. Yeah. So okay, yeah, but, dude. I brought I brought up a I brought up a, a, a fun one. What if like what if there was a class that taught you how to talk to people, that taught you about like charisma and shit? Wouldn't that have been useful? I guess that would kind of would pro probably be like a public speaking class, maybe. I don't know what yeah, a public I mean, speaking that's class like, is. That's sort though. of like. Yeah. Hmm. I because uh, I I remember in college I was taking like a, a, a what do you call it like a, a psychology class and I was like oh that's kind of you know that kind of that kind of gives you a little you know, those are my favorite classes kinda, yeah it gives you like a little bit of perspective on you know humans which you know life that's what that's what makes life life is other humans you know. Kiss took public yeah, speaking. It was useful. It was useful. Yeah. yeah, it was useful. Psychology I, I was the most interesting class. I did not do well in one of the psychology classes, but it was very interesting to learn about. You, like, reading through the textbooks, like, I hated reading textbooks, but that shit was interesting. Because, like, we, I got to read about all of, like, the mental disorders, like, um, Stockholm Syndrome and shit like that, or just, like being a sociopath and things. I mean, I don't remember all this stuff, but, you know, just shit like that. And, and I feel like it helped me realize shit about, like, myself, too. I don't know. I think everyone should take a psychology class. My psychology class taught me that, like, interacting with certain people who have autism make me cry and, like, why <laughs> that, that, that I don't need to cry about it. <laughs> Wait, why? So that was good. Oh, some of them are mean. Is there like someone specific? You know I mean? No, you just you know, it's like if someone has like pretty like crazy Aspergers, they they just like they're real staunch, kind of like a dick, and I'm like, man, why are you being mean? But no, that's just how they are, you know. Stockholm syndrome is not a real condition. Uh, it was um like phenomenons, in in um. I don't know, like, it was, uh, because the psychology book was going into shit from back to, like, Sigmund Freud to going through, like, fallacies and things like that and, like, human nature and how, like, you know, oh, hey, I, I smoked a bunch of cigarettes and I didn't get cancer, so you won't either. When it's like, you know, that's like a fallacy of thinking. So it was, like, going through all of that stuff, those type of things. It was, so it was just interesting to read about those stories. Is what I was saying. Did you want to have sex with your mom after that? No. 
One of the most interesting things I remember from that book was the uh, it, w it was fallacies. I remember um, <clears throat> there was a story of you know like um, it's almost like the hive mind kind of thinking, or like um, if you're in a crowded area and someone drops something. Are you going to be the one to pick it up, or do you just expect, oh, someone else will take care of it, you know? You know what I'm saying? Like, um, it's like the shopping cart mentality, right? It's like, uh, well, I'm not going to take it back because someone else will, you know? So, right. in this example... Or that, that, or that guy do, is going to come out of nowhere and put a sticker on your windshield and yeah. you, or park the <laughs> cart behind your car and tell you, tell you that she's stupid. Yeah, yeah. Right? <laughs> yeah, that guy. Yeah, I'm afraid of that guy. That's why I pull my car. I back always every return time. the shopping cart. I, I do too. I do too. One hundred percent of the time. I don't think I've ever left a shopping cart. Yeah, I don't think so either. Anyway, go ahead. What were you saying? Um, in this example that they were giving, there uh, it was in New York. It was like in the eighties, so it was like the height of when like crime was the worst in New York. When like just it was gangs everywhere, just horrible shit happening. And so this is a horrible story that I'm gonna explain here. There was a woman, it was late at night, I think she was walking back from work, going to her apartment. It was in a pretty bad part of town. And um, pretty much she got jumped and was physically assaulted and raped violently. And she was around all of these apartment buildings, like really, you know, a busy place. And people were awake, uh, lights were on, and she was screaming for help. Screaming and screaming and screaming. And... Obviously, people could hear her. I mean, she was that's how loud she was. And nobody called the cops. Nobody did anything. Nobody went down. Nobody tried to stop it. Nobody, nobody did anything. And so there was a study conducted that I think in interviews happened around, you know, with these people at these apartments. And one of the answers that people gave was like, oh, I expected someone else to call the cops. Or like, oh, someone else was going to do something about it. Like... I didn't do anything because I thought someone else was going to do it. And it's like the fa that's a fallacy of thinking, right? It's like, oh, someone else will take care of it. Whereas, no. I mean, like, you know, just because you think someone else is going to take care of it doesn't mean it's going to get taken care of. You have to do it. So, Jerry, I got a quick question. Yeah. Do you know, do you know, do you remember the year that happened? I, it was 80s something. I think it was 80s. Yeah, okay. I know. I, I know that case. Yeah. I know that. We actually... We... Sort of know that person. In the 80s? Yeah. We know that who that happened to? Yeah. What? I know that. I know that that case. It's super famous. Like, you and I know them personally? Uh, we may have met them. the fuck yeah it's true well you have to tell me Ask that after your mom. oh wow wait it wasn't our mom was it no oh okay <laughs> yeah shut the fuck up you're, you're sick dude. what i well, i don't know i'm jesus <laughs> my god uh but yeah I had a lady come to my front door saying her name is Gabriella. I have 20 coupons in 20 degree weather. I said I'm not interested. You shouldn't answer the door. That's scary. You're in the neighborhood watch? That's kind of badass, Max. Well, I'm, I'm so confused what's going on right now. Um, Well, now you got me real curious. Uh, anyways. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. 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 Well, anyways, uh, yeah. interesting story, though. Um, Wait, so... Yeah, go... Sorry, go ahead. What? That's it, pretty much. Oh, yeah. Just the fallacy of thinking that, like, oh, yeah, someone else would take care of it. I watched, like, an hour-long video in, like, the background one day about uh, all the all of the fallacies. It was yeah. really, really interesting. It is. There's, like, there's tons of them. And I'm, like, wondering how many of those do I fucking make a day? Like, like, oh, everyone else is doing it and they didn't get hurt. That means I won't get hurt. Like, everyone's do jumping off this cliff into this, you know, shallow water and they're not getting hurt, so I'll be fine. But that, it's a fallacy of thinking. Yeah. 
I also think learning psychology helps you with uh, problem solving and common sense, which I think we have the lack of these days. <laughs> you know? I don't know. I mean, I I'm not I'm I'm no preacher. I'm pretty dumb. So. But you could be a preacher talking about cum and Starbucks. I could be. Coffee. Uh, God, that guy's famous. I should be fucking making some weird fallacy like that. <laughs> you know what you should do? You should superimpose yourself having a conversation with that guy and post that. <laughs> I had an interview. Like, with just inter that's like I do like a fake interview where you're like talking to that guy where you're, you're like you're like wearing like a Starbucks barista thing and you're being like, I didn't put any cum in there. I didn't put any cum. I in work coffee. at Starbucks and we're gonna interview the preach the cum preacher. <laughs> that great. It's like that. Like an SSJ Jerry. It's like cum coming out of my asshole. Well I have no idea. What else do yeah. I have here? Um How are your, how are your testicles? Are they that kinda of hanging? Listen, if I'm not threatened, if I'm just over here stroking my shit, I got lotion on my dick. Yeah, I'm I'm low. If I'm about yeah, to, low. if I'm about to like, you know, I know I'm about to smash. They get high and tight. I get high and tight. Yeah. 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 Oh, Play-Doh nuts. Play-Doh nuts. Yeah, Play-Doh, my favorite philosopher's nuts. Oh, I'm Jerry. <laughs> speaking of Play-Doh. Yeah. Dude. Do you know? Do you know about the Eye of the Sahara? In Mauritania. Oh shit, that sounds really familiar. Dude, you gotta look. This Is that thing the up. Exorcist? I, Exorcist? Eye of dude, this sounds uh, like fucking Lord of the Rings shit. What is it? Eye of what? Eye of the Sahara in Mar Mauritania. Oh, dude, what do you think crop of this? circles. What do you think of this, Jerry? This picture is crazy. Is, so. Some is people it aliens? Think that that's where that's where Atlantis is, or was. Have we gone there? Yeah, there's been some people who went there. What, what do it look like? Isn't that like crazy? That looks insane. That's in Africa. I love Africa. Do you? Yeah, I do. I love Africa. Would I wish I spoke down? like Swahili or something. You know, dude. Be so cool. Have you ever heard like you ever heard them singing? Yeah, I think so. Oh, it's fuck! It's awesome. So yeah, that look. That's what do you think? Does it? Do you think that's at? Do you think that's Atlantis? Is there a scientific ex like? Is this just like some weird like rock formation or like water used to be there and it like left I like th this I pattern? This must be a collapsible thing. Um. <laughs> That's a crackhead on, energy. Crackhead. That's a <laughs> so a collapse. Oh, I guess I could see a collapse. You know what this reminds me of? What reminds me of Ocarina of Time when the like volcano that are like the you know like the mountain like the way that smoke looks around that gar Garuda Garuda or Gar Gar you know. Dude, I wish we could just do like Fortnite in this thing. You want to do like a Fortnite battle royale in this circle? Yeah, thing I want here? to do a battle royale. I want to do. I want like Peter Griffin to drop in and start shooting at like doing you know, like Ariana Grande like fucking yeah, scissor Ariana timber Grande. things. Yeah, I want to see Ariana Grande scissor Family Guy Peter. Yeah. In this and with a Fortnite or something. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah, I think Fortnite. Fortnite. Yeah, yeah, being chilling. I would be being chilling in there. <laughs> so anyway. You can everyone. You can research that on your own, and you could jack off to it probably. You yeah, you think you could nut to this? I think you could put like some boobs somewhere on that. It'd probably be jerk offable. What if we just put two next to each other? That's like kind of like kind of looks weird... like a kind of looks like my like my third nipple actually, doesn't it? It kind of looks like my asshole with shit all over it. <laughs> yeah, I really don't that... Dude, they're not like cleaning that up or anything, dude. Dude, they're doing this in the next Fortnite update? Oh my god, dude, they're putting that in Fortnite and not gonna clean it up, dude. Atlantis. See, that's Atlantis, dude. What do you think? See, I thought that they this Atlantis was underwater somewhere. Yeah, it's uh, uh, yeah. That's what Yeah, they th they uh, 
yeah, I don't know. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> Got tired in the middle of explaining that, huh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Did. Yeah, I do that. Uh, they think that there was an island out in the um, the Pacific Ocean called Lemuria, where Atlantis may have. Been. Look at this, dude. But I don't know. Isn't that beautiful? Look at that. You can see it right there, dude. It's huge. You know, it's really trippy if you go to satellite view on Google Earth and look at it, but um, it really gives you, it gives you a sense of scale. It's really crazy. So, goo -goo. something for everyone Hold to on. check out. Let me see. I don't want this to show anything here. What is this thing called? Eye of Ricotta? Uh, eye I, of uh, the Rick, Rick <laughs> Tad <laughs> structure or the <laughs> Eye of Ricotta cheese. Dude, this shit's lagging like crazy. I think this is lagging my stream. Yo, cuz have you seen the fucking, uh, those GeoGuessr, uh, players? Dude, I actually have that written down on my thing here. Oh, really? Yeah, hold on. Those, dude, those guys are fucking nuts. Yeah, they are scary good at that. Oh shit, you're in it. Nice. There it is. Dude, this thing All is right, huge. Zooming out. We're zooming out. Wow. It's so beautiful. Looks like Jupiter's red dot. Oh, yeah. Looks like a stinky brown hole, you know. Okay, I got to close out of this, though, because I'm lagging like crazy. Yeah, yeah. Um. So, anyway, food for thought. Okay, wait, I have written down here, we, so there was a time, I don't know why, but Check Dio here was, like, really into just looking up, like, competitive shit, and, like, competitive anything, like, competitive, like, jello punching, competitive whatever, competitive, um, I don't, fuck, I don't even know, you were like, what, give an example, like, competitive, like, jello. Oh, uh, yeah, we, oh, man, we got, we got into, like, all sorts I, I figured i found out that like there's competitive night fighting like people dress up in like night armor and fucking kick the shit out of it's each like other. it's like an extreme so awesome. um lurk not lurking uh what is it? uh LARP, larping? larping extreme larping yeah uh competitive like rat racing and fucking you know com there's competitive drywall installation <laughs> there's the uh, competitive like there's like there's sports in like Mongolia we've never heard of where they like they chase a fucking like yak around and I don't on horses and shit. I don't know what the fuck. It's crazy. There's yeah. like there's competitions for like literally everything. Like there was you know, a, there's like, probably competition for getting a boner. Yeah. Oh to yeah. Gay porn. Well, uh, Kiss said competitive semen retention, which hell yeah, probably. Whoa. Last how one the fuck nut. would you? How the fuck would you even measure that? Oh, it's like if you nut. Yeah, but who's watching you? Well, it would probably be like someone's getting sucked off or something, and then, like... I don't even know. Huh. I think I... Man, I gotta... Do, okay, do you remember the one thing that we saw that was probably the coolest out of the competitive shit that we watched was they played... I don't know where it was. It was, like, somewhere in Asia. They, like, did competitive volleyball, but it was with only their feet... And they were doing oh. like fucking like crazy moves. Yeah. That God, what was that called? Crazy. I don't remember what that was called. I think it's a tie sport. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but that that was that was insane. Uh, really cool. They like they do a backflip literally every time they hit the ball. Yeah. But I should see if That's I can find that. Nuts. Yeah, that is fucking crazy. Whatever that was. Oh shit! Compet I watched competitive archery, and that was the most boring shit I've ever seen. Oh really? It's it's quite fun shooting a bow, but yeah, I suppose it's a spectator sport. It's not like volleyball. Not the ball best. With the feet sport. Okay, it's called. Sp sp Dude, check this fucking shit out. Check let's all watch this fucking shit. It's called sip sipak takra sipak takra. Let me see. I wanted to see. You gotta see this shit, not in Whoa. slow motion, but like. Oh my god, look at that. He can do the split. He probably sucks on the dick. Come on, crack it! The drum, man! What? Dude, 
Dude, it's crazy. This one, th th this, this, I don't think this is the same one because the other one. Maybe this is it. They're just using their head. This is not it. Man, let me look up, let me look up Sepak. Fuck, Sepak, oh yeah, right here. Dude, check this out, okay, I think this is it. Isn't it just soccer with a different net? Dude, but it looks cool. Look at Why that ball. Like slow a motion. Ball. Pew. Pew, pew, pew. It's like, Tony, you fumbled it. You fucked up. Yeah, come on. Use your feet. I wanted to see this shit in actual motion, not just them, like, fucking being in slow motion. Wait, that was actually really sick. Hold on. Look at that shit. That's crazy. Anyways, look at that. I got ADHD. You have to, like, look at their fucking wrists must be made out of iron. I know to land like that on your fucking wrist? That floor looks hard, dude. It is more lead. Yeah. Yeah, they should. It's they should get you cockball instead. <laughs> yeah, they should. Yeah, I should be hitting it with their wiener. They could call it cocker kiss. <laughs> cocker. <laughs> Dude, I would watch the sport. <gasps> That's awesome. Is it Ty? That's a Korean flag. I saw. Flag. Oh yeah. I saw Korean. I don't know what the other flag was. I don't remember. Baby's got my heart. Dude, someone has to shatter their wrist before playing this shit. Oh, I bet. I bet they... I bet you gotta be real young to play. It's a Korean sport? It's crazy, dude. I could watch this shit for hours, dude. I wonder how the fuck they decided. Yeah, let's just use our feet for this. It's just nuts. Anyway, when do you start training for this one, you know? That's just insane. They got fucked. Yeah, actually it is. It is upscaled hacky sack. <laughs> like that, like he just did a fucking backflip. That's insane. They're like gymnasts, really. It's incredible looking. I, uh, it's I. This I shouldn't. I can keep watching this. Oh! I wonder how. Oh, he did a double. You can do that, dude. Double jump, dude. All right. Anyways, I bet these guys can double jump. Dude, I bet these guys can suck a mean cock, you know? I bet they can suck their own dicks, dude. Dude. <gasps> dude. I bet they'd like do like a splits and backflip in the midair when they suck their dick in the midair. Yeah, think? dude. They probably suck dick, dude. They probably can suck dicks. Have you ever seen competitive lumberjacking? Let's look that. Oh, wait. Oh, I think yeah. So. That's fucking cool. That's fucking crazy. They're like, <laughs> they're like using a chainsaw super fast. <laughs> That's so fucking nuts. Also, there we watched another one where it's like competitive, um, uh, like firefighting shit, and they just like they like do shit super fast like that. <laughs> they can do it for like a second. <laughs> <laughs> the double jump? No, this backflip sucking their own dick. Oh yeah, they can do it for like a second in the middle. Of it. <laughs> okay, so what's going on with these cute dudes? Oh, they, like, cut the shit. Yeah, this is very impressive. This is, like, a crazy wow, sport. So, well, th these guys are, like, lefties. That's interesting. These guys probably jerk off left-handed, dude. <gasps> dude, that's kind of crazy. Do you think any of these guys nutted in the morning? 
Like before they no came way. to this competition? There's no, 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 no way they didn't. They wanted the there's like no. retention? Yeah, there's no way you're gonna jerk Holy off. Holy shit. That. Wow, look at that, dude. These guys are nuts. Holy shit. Ooh. Oh no, don't fail. That's so high up. God, and they have to God. balance to be able to hit the fucking axe like that, too. I know, that's so fucked up. Swinging like a deadly weapon, too. How the fuck do you get into this? <laughs> yeah, how do you get into this shit? These guys could definitely jack your fucking lumber so hard. Dude, this guy, if he, try, if he got jacked off by one of these guys, your fucking dick would be dust. Dude, you think that when they jerk off, they're like, ah, fucking angry about it? Yeah, I bet, like, they really got to lube up, or otherwise they're going to fucking cause a friction thing. They, they got, like, a fucking rug burn on their dick? Yeah, I bet it's, like, getting jacked off by, like, sandpaper. You think it's, like, getting jacked off by, like, Hugh Jackman's Wolverine? I think so. They got that adamantium grip, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, they got that, yeah. Logan. Oh my god, dude, this guy's nuts. Bro, you're crazy. You're nuts. Look at this fucker. Dude, you should oh go to the god. hospital, dude. Oh god. What do they do with all this wood? <laughs> Maybe they are self inflected eunuchs and can't stop chopping. <laughs> <laughs> chop, chop, you know? Jesus. They come sawdust. Yeah, they're like not wearing any eye protection or anything, dude. Nothing. Okay, he got it. Did he win? Did that guy win? Okay, he won. He's like, okay, now I can jack off. <laughs> He's like, I can't wait to go home and finally fucking nut. Uh-oh. This guy's fucked. Oh, no. That's disappointing. What's he gonna do? He's out of steam, too. I mean, that's a lot of energy to fucking... This is nuts. I wonder... Is, I don't think I've... This must be like an old world way of like... Uh, chopping trees down and shit. This kind of reminds me of, like, being in, like, a Banjo-Kazooie, like, level or something, you know? <laughs> Timber sports. Damn. Timber sports. Yeah, let me see these guys sawing here. Hot saw world record. Shiver me timbers. Holy What's he gonna do? shit. Alright, quick, make a flashlight out of this. <laughs> <laughs> I have sex with wood. That guy's fucking jacked. That guy Yeah, like, but I can that stall must fucking weigh like seventy pounds. Huh? That guy fucking eats a T bone with the fucking bone in. What do you think Dude. it's like when that guy jacks off? I probably just like pure hatred coming out of his wiener. <laughs> you know? It's like pure fucking hatred. Let me see this person climbing. Oh, yeah, these oh, ones are crazy. Shit, dude. This is really high up. That guy slipped. Oh, my God. Too. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Dude, my butthole would be inside of me if I did this. Dude, I would probably not be able to come when I got home. Oh. Oh, my God. They just fall like that. Holy uh. shit. Wow. That's crazy. Oh, I want to see the, like, competitive... 
firefighter. F oh wait, fight fighter, fire fire fighter. Okay. Did this shit? Yeah, that's how you get a splinter in your fucking lasagna, dude. I don't think I've seen this one. This one. This is oh the what are they Russian? I I don't know if I've seen this one either, but they're like. Gotta connect like a hose and shit. God, they're all in that gear too. Oh yeah, they're probably sweating. I wonder how they score this. It's like, oh, you, you walk down every step. Maybe it's just like a. <laughs> and he bing he binged that thing good. Maybe just like the time? Hey, grab this thing. Squirt it a little bit. Save this guy. Have sex with this mannequin over here. Now you can have sex with this guy. Name is Jim. We're gonna have sex with this thing. Penetrate its ass. I gotta cut. You gotta make sure you come in it. Oh, if you don't come, you get disqualified. Yeah, if you did, if you don't have any pre cum or any squirt coming out. This one. This is it. I think this is the thing that I watched. Oh, this is like an hour. Yeah, they're like, do this ladder shit, dude. Oh, he fucked up. That's a weird one, huh? What is it? This is firefighting? I guess. Or just ladder climbing. Maybe it's just ladder climbing. NYS champion drill highlights. I bet I uh, watched uh, competitive drywalling. Yeah, let me watch that one. Wait, that's, look at this. That's very interesting. What is this? That's the shit that I saw. What the fuck? Yeah. Holy shit! Check this out one more time. <laughs> that shit's fucking crazy. This is nuts. This would really suck if this is the only way you could get off. Yeah, imagine if you could only jerk off to videos like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Imagine if you uh, only got off the shit like this. Baby, I can't come into you. I haven't climbed up a ladder today yet. <laughs> like, <laughs> hey, babe, I really want to be intimate tonight, but can we please put this on in the background? You know? <laughs> <laughs> it's the only way I can come. You ever watch the Red Bull box car competition? Oh, I have. I have. Where they make, like, the different types of cars and see, like, if they can go over jumps and shit. Oh yeah, one it one of those actually flew for a bit, didn't they? <laughs> Did it? I think so. They, they always fail, but yeah. Competitive um, drywalling. This shit. Yeah, yeah. This one, this one's crazy. You don't have to watch it all, but just two, just two X's. He's running away. Come on, crack it. This is yeah, that's right. This guy, this guy in the red is what? beast. Kind of makes it it makes it seem like they're going like a lot crazier than they are look at this they're, like, they're gonna they're gonna do a whole interior for like what though you know what i for mean like, like nothing it's like just like, yeah for like nothing <laughs> it's like such a fucking waste dude it yeah uh, it's crazy to do that job alone dude I don't, yeah it's fucking know. crazy all right let's go watch red bull okay yeah all right Red Bull. What are they called? I don't know. Or the Barbie car downhill competitions? Which one? <laughs> oh, yeah. What do they call that? Box car or whatever? Or soapbox? Dude, look at... There's so much competitive shit you could just find all the time. Oh, wait. This is still in 2X. Fuck. 
<laughs> it looks so funny in T-Rex. <laughs> Did you know you can just press shift and... What is that? Comma or period to slow it or speed it up? Oh, whoa. Oh, whoa, really? If you hold shift and then the comma or period. Oh, whoa. Isn't that nice? Dude, that is cool. Also, how do people, like, only go, like... Some people do, like, increments instead of, like, five seconds. They do, like... It's the arrow keys, right? Yeah, but you... Yeah, can you fine-tune it anymore? Does it hold shift and then do arrow no, keys? No, that still Is just that does just... five seconds. Oh. Ellen J. I just want to see someone fuck up. There's a bunch of rednecks over here. Oh, he failed. That thing keeps turning. Come on, get back in there, bud. <laughs> this is like the rodeo. Oh, you can use comma and period to move one frame at a time. It's not working. Oh, L and J? Oh, that's 10 seconds. Common period don't work. Oh, whoa. What the fuck? Oh, that doesn't work. What the fuck are we doing? I don't know. This is all... You know what? You know, you know, I, we can't watch it on YouTube, but I've been watching... Uh, sometimes I watch that um, Backyard Brawls or whatever. Oh. Wait, that sounds familiar. What is that? It's it's like a it's like a like an off-brand UFC where they like set up like shop at somewhere in like some fucking guy's backyard and they like two people like fight each oh, other. Oh wow! We want, we want to fight each other, and you get some you get some wacky characters. You think we're allowed to watch this on Twitch? It's like people just hurting it. Kind of like Kimbo Slice, exactly. Actually, oh no. No, isn't there like a fail army like channel on Twitch that is like twenty four? Yeah. There is. It's pretty uh, censored, though. Oh yeah. I guess if no one's bleeding, then it's probably fine, right? Yeah. Holy shit. <laughs> is there like competitive slip and sliding, or that's probably gonna get like sexual, huh? What really? Competitive slip and sliding. Dude, world records fastest slip and slide. World's longest backyard slip and slide. World's fastest. Competitive spanking. Oh, of course there is. Oh, wait. We've seen this. I've seen this, I think. Wait, we've seen this? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, oh I think you've God, definitely I'd looked this up. Before. That thing. Dude, this would be sick. I would love to do this. Holy shit. Woo! Yeah, get more aerodynamic there. What's the world record right there? That better be a hot day. He's all soaked up. Soaping up the floors and shit. What if someone shit themselves on that? Yeah. God, yeah, how do you hold it straight there? That's crazy. Do you remember? Do you remember when we were kids and we went over to like the neighbor's house and they set up a slip and slide and that fucking one kid pissed on it? And then he, then he was like trying to like, he was like, I didn't pee on it. And it's like, dude, it's fucking yellow, dude. You pissed on it. Ew. No, I don't remember that. Do remember Maybe that? I peed. No, you didn't pee. It was him. He was sitting. He was sitting there. I saw yellow leaking right out of his shorts. Ew. Oh, fuck. It's fucking gross. Fucking kids, man. I, I hate it that, like, any pool you go into, there's definitely just, like, a lot of piss in there. Wait, you saw... You saw... You saw Joji? What? Wait, there's... I don't know. There was Joji and iDubs? Well, anyways. Um... 
I don't know anymore. I don't know either. I think that's kind of it, guys. I think that's the first goblin slap today. You guys aren't killing it. Where's the, we need more goblin slaps. Yes. Um, I think that's it. I feel bad because the stream like fucked up for like 30 minutes, but we went a little extra longer here today, I guess. Um, I don't know. I gotta clean my kitchen. You gotta clean the chicken? Yeah, because I got maggots and stuff in there. Oh, yeah, gross. Or some type of larva. Uh, uh. I, you know what? I don't want to raid anyone tonight. Guys, do I have to raid? No raid. Do I have to raid anyone tonight? I just don't want to. Is that rude? Is it? Kiss. Sometimes when it gets spammed like that, it doesn't work. I will play that for you though, so it doesn't feel like you just wasted it. Hold on. What do you owe them anyways? Fucking nothing. Here. There you go. Give you another one. Oh, you helped me forget that I had COVID for a while. Oh, that's kind of sweet. That's very nice. I'm sorry, dude. That sucks. That's not good at all. Yeah, that sucks, dick. I hope you, uh, uh, when did you get it? How long ago did you get it? How long have you had it for now? Yeah, I hope you heal up. Oh, you got it yesterday. So you're in the thick of it for sure. Into the thick of it. Into the thick of it. I don't know what this is supposed to be. Uh yeah, it's, well, I don't. Is that is it a is it bad or? I, you know, I don't even know. I, I probably like. I hope I hope uh I hope it's not gonna like hit you. But have you had COVID before? I don't know what the JN one variant is either. I don't know either. One other time. That might soften the blow. I don't know how different things will be, but I remember the first time I had it, I like I was sick for like a whole month. It was really oh, awful. Boy. Oh my god. Yeah. I was like I had a fever for like a week. It was so brutal. I was definitely yeah, I was out of commission for like seven days. So and, uh, and I told you, like, the month after that, like, I just was out of it. Like, there was just, like, a brain fog just, like, every single day, so. I couldn't taste yogurt. I couldn't taste fucking anything. It was horrible. I, Kiss, I really hope that does not happen to you. The, the loss of smell and taste is, like, debilitating. <laughs> Yeah, it's really fucked up. I like I basically only ate sourdough bread, bananas, and yogurt. Ugh. Because I love eating. I love yeah, food. It's and my if I can't one taste drug. it. Yeah, I know, dude. Can't taste my Cheez Its? No. That's not good. Gotta taste them Cheez Its. What flavor? Just original? Is that a, yeah, is, or is it like the cheddar, white cheddar cheese? Is it the jalapeno? Yeah, you're doing the jalapeno? 
Fuck nuggets. I ate piss. I ate duck. Puffed. Ooh, uh, you get the puffed ones. You love a puffed oh, pussy. Yeah. Dude, baked cheese, that's a really fucking good. Dude, yeah, the extra baked ones. Yeah, those are so good. Toasty dude. ones. Yeah, I kind of like that. Yeah, those are really good. I'm tired now. Kiss, yeah. feel better. Seriously. Yeah, feel, feel better. Let me play you out. Let me play you a song, motherfucker. Um, let me play my shit. Let me play my shit. Okay, here's a song time for you. Song time. Put some soul into that one just for just for you boys. Okay. That's it though. Socials and all that stuff. I'm not gonna rate anyone because fuck them, you know. <laughs> fuck them. Uh, cause I, I just wanna like <laughs> I don't wanna like, you know. I don't wanna have to like be like, oh, you know, hey, what's up? And like, you know, I just wanna, <laughs> I just, I just wanna fucking go. So <laughs> You know what I'm saying? So I'm just being a piece of shit, you know, tonight, you know, so. Uh, you guys go where you want to go. You know, Higsley's streaming. Track number seven is streaming uh, the finals. Higsley's going Warframe, you know. Brozyme's on. Uh, there's a bunch of other people. Edric's on. He's playing Mega Man something. You know, hey. Mega 64 is streaming right now. I don't know what they're doing. They're up late. What's Mega 64 doing? We could... We could raid mate. You know what? Let's raid Mega 64. We're doing. We could Oh shit. Yes, I'm going to you know, I'm going to raid mate. I'm going to raid Mega 64. All right. That's what we're going to do. All right. There we go. Let's it's it's going to You should watch Mega 64. I love Mega 64. This is, you know, it's my favorite boys right there, okay? We're going to watch them. All right. So, have a good night, everyone. Eat shows and stuff. <laughs> and suck it. Oh. Okay, bye bye.